Yes, yes, yes. Good night, good night, good night to you one and all. My viewers and subscribers, wherever in the world you are, I take this opportunity to welcome you to Jamaica Hot Topic, where we bring you the hottest and latest news happening in and around Jamaica. As usual, it plans to be another exciting, entertaining and informing live stream. So please... All you have to do is to hit the like button. Hit the like button as you come into the class. And if you would like a shout out, just type your name in the comments and me bless you up. My viewers and subscribers, we have a whole heap to talk about tonight. We have the police commissioner for talk about. Because apparently them not looking at Fitz Bailey. We, my viewers and subscribers, them not looking for Fitz Bailey. Them not contending Fitz Bailey to as far as where I hear. Apparently, I don't know if them say, boy, fix up. You're not ready for that one yet. So my viewers and subscribers are going to talk about the new police commissioner. We are going to talk about you know, Big News Prime Minister Devon. We are going to talk about Big News Devon. Devon is still a true word from people, you know. Devon still a walk a true word from people, you know, my viewers and subscribers. And I'm going to show it to you tonight. We are also going to be talking about Tough Tom. My viewers and subscribers, you know, say the JLP party are tumbled down. The JLP party are tumbled down, tumbled down, tumbled down. We don't have nothing for sake of we want it tumble right down because the whole of them are wicked. But nonetheless, we're going to start the class with a song as usual. My viewers and subscribers, I want to take this opportunity to say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, that you ever thought of me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, that you ever thought of me. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, me have a big up, Father God. But anyway, listen to that little music here and make we start the class. Hit the like button, students. Welcome to Jamaica Our Topic. Good night. Government. Minister Desmond McKenzie says he has taken note of a statement. Oh, sorry, my brother, subscribers. Wrong video, that. Wrong video, that. Good night, good night, good night. Welcome to the video. Hit the like button. Walk your hoes and praise him. Show his name and praise him. Give him glory, no. Give him that glory, no. Give him that glory, no. Give him that glory, no. My God. My God. Big up all of the people when we say God good and a God will put a trust in a, and a man. And when the wicked them try to tear with dung, Father God is still good. When the wicked them try to bring with dung, Father God is good. I will never will see we falter. Never hit the like button, students, and listen to this. Go down, bad mind. JLP problem them double up. JLP on a problem them double up, double up, double up. And PNP blessing just a double up, double up. JLP problem them and bad mind people problem them, them sad. No matter how much money them have, them sad. No matter how much money them thief, them live in a Beverly Hills and them unhappy. Them live in a big house. Them have everything what them want and them unhappy. And poor PNP blessing just a double, double up. My brother subscribers, good night to you all. Yeah, all of the clean out people. Them good night. Double up. 
Students type God good. Type God good in the comments. Wave off the crosses, them in your house. My viewers and subscribers, lift up your and a wave off bad mind and envious people. Wave off the Eden, them wave them off, wave them off, wave them off, them can't stop you, wave them off. Well, on the students, God good man. God good man. God good man, students, hit the like button for me. Hit the like button, hit the like button, hit the like button. Hello. Come on, students, a late night, but rock. Rock and tell God say, from Monday to Friday, when I go work, I want to come in back safe and no accident, no harm. Rock and tell God say, yesterday to Friday night, are you all right? You're not hungry. You have a place to sleep. I warm to them. Hello? Praise him. We have your honor. Praise him. For I want to go to heaven when I die. We go here when child and my God. And I hear this musician play it up. Give God glory, musician. Tell them, play it for David. Play it for David. Play me David. Play it for David. Yes, play me David. Play it for the high. Yes, play me David. Play it for David. We say roll, Jordan. We say roll. Walk in the student, walk and move up your foot them. Walk in your blessing. Go bad mind. Go bad mind. Go. Go. Go over there so bad mind. Go. Go. Walk in your blessing, student.
Yes, yes, yes. We go here when child had oh. Somebody shout a praise to God. Praise the Lord for the Lord is good and his mercy is, is everlasting. And his truth endure it forever. Good night to you students. Welcome to Jamaica. Our topic, let me go ahead and mark the register. Because I see when Prime Minister Devon a play a game with the people him. Him come like him forget the election just go on and him never win. It come like Devon forget the election just go on and him never win. My viewers and subscribers, when I show you where Devon go on with, I want to tell me. Let me mark the register. Lady J, good night to you. Nicola Green, good night. Venus Sang, good night. Diaspora Diva say blessing. Uh, blessed night, my teach, my blessed night, my studios teacher. I was just panicking. Didn't think you were coming on tonight. Bless up my fellow moderators and students. Class will be extraordinary tonight as usual. Big up yourself. China, good night to you. Hurling Edwards, good night to you. Uh, Sandra Plunkett, blessings to you. Shernet, Burnett, Andrew Mack, Danet Harriet. Larry's Beckford, Patrick Woodstock. Patrick said, watching from Brandon Hill, St. Andrew. Big up my classmates and teacher. Big up yourself, Dion, Candy Neal, a long time in a year. Welcome, Dean Singh, as I travel TV. Tisa Taylor, welcome. Happy to see you in class today, Tisa Taylor. Sabbath Roads, blessings to you. Jermaine, God is good. Christine Phillips, Marie, Kadia Bridge Mahan, Carleen Brown, Colleen Stewart, Anthony Williams, Daphne Jackson, Marie, Everton Facey, Camille Tomlinson, who else may not bless up? Rudolph Roan, Darren Daly, Sharon Fab. Juliet Campbell, Scully Guga, Scully Guga, big up yourself, no, Scully Guga, big up yourself, Scully Guga, what a name, squeeze me, big up yourself, Tracy and Turner, Lord Jesus, the name them run off of the comments, every time this always happens where the comments them run off of the screen, I want me just there a while ago, well on students, me just there, uh, squeeze me, Tracy and Turner, Jean Wright, God is good, Candy Key and big up yourself, Viv Chin, Gloria Murphy, everybody big up on yourself, Colette Vaz, welcome to the class, Colette Vaz. Big up yourself, Marie Murray. Big up yourself, everybody. Blessings to you, one and all. Andrea Hunt, welcome to the class, Andrea Hunt. Danet Ariat, big up yourself. Pretty, pretty. Welcome, pretty, pretty. Beverly Lawrence, good night. Andrea Burke, good night to you and welcome to the Moderator Club. Alison Garda, good night. Cynthia Campbell, blessings to you, Beverly Lawrence. Shelly Ann Stevens, how are you doing, Shelly Ann? Welcome to the class, man. Donovan Christie, good night to you, sir. Who else may not bless up yet? Special Wagwan, Gloria Bode, Tajay, uh, Millings, good night to you, Noreen McLean, Egla Fletcher, Joan Francis, Marcia Leng, big up yourself, Nicola Green, Nadi, how you doing, Nadi? Janet Farkison, long time in the area, Janet Farkison, oh, Janet Farkison say, uh, good night. Emmeline Clark, good night to you. Karen, Karen, blessings to you, Skinny Clark, Beverly Lawrence, Stacey and Stoner. Carol Sutherland, everybody in the class, blessings to you. Nama Mackenzie, Myrtle Thompson, Osia Phipps, big up yourself. Angela Burke, so welcome to Janet to class, her first time here. Welcome, Janet, is your first time. And to all the people who is your first time, big up yourself. Thermotise Miller, big up yourself. Arlene from Watma Arlene, Mark Panton, big up yourself. Lana Silvera, everybody, blessings to you. Everybody in the class, blessings to you. I'll soon call you the name again, all right? Geraldine Bennett. Big up yourself, everybody. Navlet Davis, Charlene Gear, Stephen Lalu. Let me talk the business them now. Let me talk the business them, Joyce Brown. My brothers and subscribers, I see one bangarang. I may go put it on my screen. I wish part of bangarang you go on students on the wall and a big excitement teacher go put up, you know. A big excitement me go put up, you know. It look like all war out for bro. My brothers and subscribers, I go put up one excitement on my screen or so. And I want to tell me I wish part of this excitement you go on. Let me see which one of the students them have them ears on the ground. Let me see which one of the students has their ears on the ground. I see some excitement today. I see like, I don't know what go on, but I see some excitement. Today. Look here. Look here. Well, I'm a brother subscribers. I'm going to eat the live button for me. 
me go put that piece of excitement up on my screen. And I want you to tell me a wish part this excitement you go on and who are who did involve. Talk to me, my brothers and subscribers. When I put it up on the screen, I'll be watching the comments to see what you and you and you have to say about it. Well, I'm maximize the video, yes? See, tell my viewers and subscribers, you know, watch this a piece of excitement, you know. Watch this a piece of excitement that is about to be unfold. Which part is up, my students? A PNP and JLP people there, so where do you are for? My viewers and subscribers, you know, hit the like button for me, you now. Hit the like button, students. I'm going to type in the comments. I want really to go on here. So, a Jamaica, this year. A Jamaica, this year. Look on this, year. Look on this and tell me if this is Jamaica, my viewers and subscribers. Tell me if this is Jamaica land we love. We don't see all shoving and going. We don't see all shoving and pushing. My brothers and subscribers, no, sir. I want to tell me which part this is going. And where the people in my war, Miss Lady, in her white top and her green something. She and the lady in her orange both for have one little toss off. I wanted to watch a video and type in the comments and tell me which part this is going. So Wolande, I'm seeing that you guys are saying in Spanish tone. So so Awaguana swearing in Aguana Spanish tone. What was happening in Spanish tone that caused this crowd to gather and make Mary Jane and Amara so out for war them one another? What is it that caused this event that people were gathered today in Spanish Town? Students, a teacher did very busy today. I found the time for filming at the mix up and tell me what go on. What happened today in Spanish Town that caused these people to gather together? Would you type in the comments and tell me? People <laughs> jump up, man. I don't know easy, man. I don't see people meet them. You then jump up. You're all Okay, I read you, I read you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my viewers and subscribers. A banga rang ya for Guan ya now. Wakas is a banga rang want to type in the comments ya so. Somebody said JLP give out two hundred thousand or two million dollar and I'm seeing in the comments where one of our classmates, Shelly Ann Stevenson, said she lost her aunt. I just want to take this opportunity to say condolences. Students, let us say condolences to Shelly Ann Stevens. You know, she, she just received news that w she has just lost one of her family members. And, you know, it is a hard thing to lose any family member. So while we're in the midst of the class, you know, so, uh, 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 we deal with things different over here. And the whole of is one. So even though I'm having the class, it has been brought to my attention that one of our classmates, Shelly Ann Stevenson, lost one of her family members. And I ask you, my viewers and subscribers, just to take the time out to send her condolences to her and her family member. And Shelly Ann Stevenson, we wish you all the best and we just pray your strength. All right, my sister? Big up yourself, you know? It's a topic there. Anytime you want to laugh, you call me. Ring my phone. Let me tell you something about Devon for try and make you laugh. All right? Big up yourself, Shelly and Steve. Enough love to you. But back to the meat of the matter. Somebody say Everton faces it to vote and them take the money and vote them out. Students, when I only tell me what really happened now and stop the joking at the comments because I only love the mix up, you know. Can one of the bright students tell me exactly what happened in Spanish town today that caused all that kind of bangarang? Because Miss Mary Jane pushed Miss Mary Sue. And it looked like a big war out for Brock, my viewers and subscribers. But me, one hour the war gone over. Was it that there was a swearing ceremony of the mayor? 
That is the question that I'm asking you. My viewers and subscribers, I want you to type in the comments and fill me in. But nonetheless, I have something that me and Uno want to talk about because Uno, Uno, Uno Prime Minister, movie star Devon at it again. Movie star Devon at it again. My viewers and subscribers, well, I'm going to ask you one question. Let me look for something. Do we have any public servants on the live here? I want to ask you a question, my brothers and subscribers. Do we have any public service on the live? I am asking you a question. Do we have any teacher on the live? Do well, Any nurse on the live? Do we have, have any civil servants who work in a Jamaica that is on this live right now? Because your big news, Prime Minister Devon, me see Devon put up something. And when me see me say, Lord Jesus, election just gone and Devon start with the comedy again. Lord Jesus, my brothers and subscribers, you know what I make a topic put up this a drama on the screen, yes or no? Because it, you know, say, hello, hello, somebody really need to carry Devon go up a Bellevue, you know? Me de think it a thief, him thief and lie and wicked. But I am beginning to come to the conclusion that this man, something is wrong with him mentally. I am of the conclusion that something is wrong with the Prime Minister. My brothers and subscribers, you know wait till me put up when I go put up on the screen there. You know what I make me put up my mix up on the screen or so. You know what our students, hit the like button for me and send the likes to 300. Hit the like button my viewers and subscribers. Make I take the JLP them and put them one side there so. My brothers and subscribers, you know, look on the screen right there so now. Look on the screen. Yeah, yeah, where the, yeah, see where the people them type as a wickedness can done. My brothers and subscribers, look where the people them type right as a wickedness can done. Look on this, yeah. On the screen is on a big friend, big nose Devon with him hand up in the ear like him under arrest. Big nose Devon with him hand up in the ear like him under arrest. Look what Devon right, uh, come out and tell Jamaican people. Let me read it for you. Devon say, wholeness. Cautions public servants again exerting pressure on government about their compensation, warning it could collapse the fiscal system. My viewers and subscribers. My viewers and subscribers. I wonder if I read when I read when I read. My viewers and subscribers. You know, some old for start the drama, I'm old for start the bangarang now. It's late to you know, I'm old for start the bangarang, I'm old for start. Dirty man. Big nose, dirty, nasty man. You forget that you a walk and tell people about, oh, this economy is performing the best and it's performing well uh, over... Co Hello, anybody remember that Devon, before election and during election, him a walk and tell everybody about, oh, this government is the best. They're fixing the economy and the economy is on its way. So if the economy is on its way and things are go all right, if the nurses them and the teacher and the doctor and all of the civil servant and the fireman them, if them ask for their money, oh, the backside, the system are going to collapse. See then, so what did that dirty man do? My brothers and subscribers, me just see somebody say big up Ed Girl. Me just see somebody say big up Ed Girl. Ed Girl, big up herself. I never did I read the comments. Somebody else said, uh, Einstein, but I said, a topic, me sick of Jamaica, pure effray. My brothers and subscribers, remember is this man has been walking and telling everybody oh the economy is doing well and this government know to manage your economy and this government all right well i'm gonna find one video for you for sure and lie me i tell well i remember find something for you for sure and say i lie me i tell pan big news devon wait wait remember make no ear listen my brothers and subscribers devon is saying let me repeat devon cautions public servants against exerting pressure on government about their compensation warning that that it could collapse the fiscal system so him say him a tell the teachers and the nurses and the firemen and all of the people who work in the government office said do nobody come pressure the government about on the salary I want the money we want to forget. Nobody come with that because if you come with that, it'll go press, it go collapse the fiscal system. Oh, the backside the fiscal system for collapse when you a walk and tell people a foreign and yard and country say you a fixed economy and economy are doing. How the backside this? Students, only listen to this drama now. Listen, all this money I go send himself go to prison. 
Sadiq, no you Sadiq, how are the box? See what you then, see no Sadiq, some money out to give me one nervous breakdown. This, my brothers and subscribers, remember that this man is championing. Say, oh, my government fixed the economy. Listen to this. Only listen to him. I'm send himself. Go preso. Listen to this. Listen to this. You come in like a man who has sweet mouth. Hold on. Another one here. Only one of my brothers and subscribers. Come in big nose, Devon. Because no matter where you do now, get away. Come in with your big nose. No matter where you do now, get away. Listen to this. Listen to this. Listening, GLP and PNP and independent and frustrated and cynical people who are listening. The only way that we are going to deal with any problem that you have, whether you've exposed water, whether you've exposed road, or you just exposed everything, don't make nobody tell you foolishness for them will come tomorrow and solve your problem. The only way they can address anything in a Jamaica is by making that economy grow. Yes, sir. And there's only one government yes, sir. that has ever done that in the history of America. But you, on the hearing, him saw one government alone ever grow the economy. So if your backside government grow the economy, why the backside? My viewers and subscribers, you know, say me go beg one hour for calling now. Me never want to ask somebody for calling yet, but, but me alone can't talk about this. Come here, go get a nervous breakdown. No, no, all on the students. Lord Jesus. This is a man out for trust. Me no blood pressure, you know. I don't have no blood pressure, but Devon look like him want to give me high blood pressure. My viewers and subscribers, I want to ask the, your man, you know what? A good for summer, you know. A backside good for summer, you know. You know who, you know who it good for? The, the labor right one, then we go vote for Devon. You see, all of the police, then we go vote for Devon in our election. We go vote for JLP. You see, all of the nurses, then we go vote for JLP in our last election. You see, all of them, me not have nothing to say. Me not defend, you know. Make me shut my trap. Make me shut my trap. Because police must vote for Devon, nurse must vote for Devon, fireman must vote for JLP for make JLP can say that them get several seats, them get several parish council. If Uno never vote for Devon, Devon wouldn't get so much parish council and say Uno vote to me now. And the first thing Devon come out come telling you is that Uno can't get on the money backside for summer Uno, backside for summer Uno, backside for summer Uno. Me no sorry for some of Uno. My student, them, they over here when I vote for Devon. Me sorry for them. But Uno, we go vote for Devon. Me no sorry for Uno. My brother, subscribers, you see how this man wicked? Remember, say, just beg the people, you know, for vote for me, you know, and say, I go fix up everything, you know. And as Devon go in at the election and tell himself, say, him win. Although the whole of we know him no win. The first order of day where Devon come out is said to Uno, say, all I own a civil servant, let me make sure I tell you no. Nobody come ask me for the money, you know. I don't Devon tell you, you know. Devon make sure I tell you, say, oh, you know, nobody come ask me for the money, you know. I don't must stay there. I want to call me. Well, I'm going to fix the phone as a student. I want to, I want, me, no, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Devon, you're going to get rubbed out for this, you know. What you mean by my viewers and subscribers? Well, I'm going to zoom it up so somehow you can't see on the screen, you know. Somehow it come like some people now really see what I say good, you know. So let me zoom it up a little bit more so everybody can see what I talk about. Well, I'm going to zoom it up because some people not get the, 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 the picture yet. So then look here. Look if you can't see it good on the screen now. Look. Look if you can't see the words good on the screen now. When you see the word big, let me know if you see the word big, big, big pan on the screen. When you see the word big pan on the screen. When you see the words them big pan on the screen if you can't read it. On the Prime Minister, we on the just vote for. Some on the vote for him. Nurse vote for him. Teacher vote for him. Police vote for him. And as him win, him say, listen to me. On the better not come ask me for the pain. Lord Jesus, what a wicked and grateful dirty man. What a wicked son of a rice and, and, and I don't even know if I call him. Oh, this uh, my viewers and subscribers. Oh, this a dirty man as a wicked man. You mean to tell me, say, you just come out and beg the people to vote for you. And as the people em come out, come vote for you, sir. The first thing you go come tell the people em say, is that you know no money for give them and they must ask you for the money because it's going to collapse the system. So when you did a walk a promise, when you walk a promise market, 
My viewers and subscribers, when you see all this, a dirty drunk or wicked. When you tell people about my bill market, and my bill market everywhere, and I bill port more, and I bill everywhere. Don't bill no backside and give the teacher and the nurses them, them. My viewers and subscribers, I want to call me. I'm sorry for create the drama so, so early, but it's necessary. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, I'm a brother and subscribers. I'm sorry for the excitement, but no, sir. Me got home with the phone line and I want to call me. You don't have to call me. You don't have to call me, my viewers and subscribers. You don't have to call me. I say, you don't have to call me. Well, and then I can fix this, sir. You don't have to call me. So when I'm a student, then put up my number, no? When I'm a moderator, then please put up my number up on the screen so the students can call me, no? Because this is outrageous, my viewers and subscribers. And 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 him, and him a walk a throw word from people again, you know. Me a go make on the ear how him that road a walk out throw word from people because that's all him do. Walk and throw word from people. Well, I me make on the ear him a walk a throw word from people. Well, and you know, so you see as him win, you see as him win, he, him claim same win. Put it in a female, but we know him don't win. You see as election done, my viewers and subscribers, well, and there. Uh, as election done, the first thing they come out come telling us, oh, me am telling this, all I want to go, I mean, I no money for giving, I want to. I do no money for giving that one. I would the backside something that we did have a play, man. Well, I'm a very good subscriber, as Chow. When I'm a very good subscriber, when you hit the like button for me, please, I'll send up the like button. Hit the like button for me, my very good subscriber. Send up the like button, let me check something there. Hit the like button, then my viewers and subscribers. Let me check for what audio. Come here, have everything for you know. Everything I have for you tonight. Well, on. Today, we lost out more by four. More real estate. Well, I'm a viewers and subscribers. Everything I have for you. Hit the like button for me. They may go over the phone lines. That man is too wicked, man. I'm too wicked. Celsius in Kingston, 28 out west in Montego. Well, and them my viewers are subscribed. Oh, no, come on, man. Oh, some of them start okay. giving me a problem as me I talk about the wicked man. From the... And later in our broadcast, in our... No, another audio there. Me soon play the audio for you. Me, I go find it. Him a walk a trace people. But people benefit from PNP and people do this with him big nose self. With him big nose, but him not talk about, about oh, him and him friend them from the SS smell comp. My brother subscribers, you know, so I can't deal with this, man. I can't deal with this, man. Because I'm not like foolishness, you know. I can't hear foolishness in my ears every day, you know. But I'm not sorry for some of the civil servants, them. Me not, me not. We well, yeah, you know, call me, you know, my brother subscribers. You know the phone number. Somebody pin the number up top for me, you no. Know. Pin the number up top. Make the students them call me and talk up the things, them, you no. Know. Since, since now they call, they pin the number up top there. Uno 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 pin the number and call me the students. Uno call me there. Uno call me there. Uno oh the man means say eh? the people em now get them pay. Man, I you mean say election just you come and beg the people em for vote for you and them vote for you. And as election done, the first thing you choose to do is to tell the people em say you now pay them. And not for come ask you for the money. You just say you are wicked first class, second class, wicked dirty man. No sir. Well, and they call a good night. Welcome to our topic. Talk to me, then no one tell me, oh, your big nose prime minister. Wicked. Oh, the man wicked, some man. He man of a prime minister, sir. What him is? He man of a prime minister. You don't know, so the man sick. You don't know, so the man are mad. The man so end up at Bellevue, you know, brother. Right beside Bellevue, you know. So, I will help carry him over there when he call my gate, you know. I go in, I go in, you know. So you say you live beside a Bellevue and when them carry him come up a Bellevue, you will come out from over your yard and go help carry him inside. Put him on one I ward them. When I turn up a gate, I get a look of him when I come, but I don't see them carry me in yet. Come me over the next road and look over the gate to see, you know. But I don't know if they don't care in Bung today, so. My brother, let me ask a question. Remember, sir, this, uh, me just played for you, know, the man said one government alone know for fix the economy and a film government. You know, you me just played a while ago. So if him, if him, a fix, if him fix the economy, oh, the backside, you are going to come cuss the teacher and the nurse, them, and you are going to come tell them, say, hello, me can't give you no money, you know, so nobody come ask. How are the rat it, my brother? Jesus. I, my brother, you know, so you have no police and nurse and fireman who vote for Devon. Hear this, hear this now. You see the economic we not have a fix. A thief, a thief, the money and that are the fixing. Fixing for thief all of the money. Nobody not get no money, you know. That's why we forget him out. That's why we forget him out. We make him win back. I 
I can't believe the man. Remember, so at 2 o'clock, the man come out your yard, come beg you for vote for him. 4 o'clock in the morning, the man come out your yard, come beg you for vote for him. And as the next one done, he might tell you, say hello. Nobody come ask me for no money, you know. Nobody come ask me for no salary. Come over the box, say, no, he might go to prison. He need to go to prison for wickedness and for oppressing the people. He might to go to prison. We see one something from the, 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 the uh, Google where the, the integrity commission have had a pint pan in right now, finger present. Don't lie. What you say? What, what you say, my brother? Repeat what you say. I Google something the other day and I see where the integrity commission, uh, commission have finger pan him for giant off your whole for money while we to mix up with this boy. He must go to prison. He has to go to prison. You hold on, you know, you're not yet. He just go to prison. The man wicked. You hold on the money, you have to pay shit for you hold on the MP them. And you hold on friend them and you hold on them. And so then the for Siaga Bees, and so Siaga Yosubu. It's a, it's a tradition of them. A long time they do this thing, you know. It's a tradition, Siaga. I'm going one of them end the day, you know, get no time for tea for the booze. You understand? But mm -hmm. Siaga, a long time them do it. That's why Michael would have hold him down, could make him with a partisan call, hold him again. He hear him here. And you never buy them thing with partisan. Them money are dying, be a rub and teeth, them money are the better. Be a rub and teeth and crime. See that? Crime there, Jamaica, to the neck. I am a little go away to carry so you're good. I mean, I'll fix it, but you know, go abroad, go fix it. Hello, me did, hello, that. me did tell you, you know, me did tell you, you know, say, look out for him and him people, him jump up, say, they're going to leave charge for going to 80. But did tell you, you know, remember yesterday, the day before, me tell you, you know, say, look out for big nose Devon, I come tell you, you know, say, him I go make the soldier them go down at 80. You know, remember, me did tell you that yesterday, the day before, who member type, yes? And who no member say, say no. Who member type, yes. Remember yesterday, the day before, me tell you, say, look out for big nose, Devon, I go say, who no, who no soldier them, them I go send, who no JDF soldiers them go down. You know what, my brother? You know what? Just take one minute and wrap up, because the phone lines are blame us. What a wicked dirty man. A dirty dog, that man, he's so mad. I wait, me I wait, man, if you push him through Bellevue Gate, right now, me I wait. So you out of Bellevue, you live right beside Bellevue. And you say, as him come a Bellevue, you yeah, help push him in I gate. Yes, man, I yeah, tie jacket down all in thing you want put over the dirty bitch, man. But then you see them come with him. You, you, better make, you, 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 you better make sure you have two tie strap. And you make sure you have two tomatoes. Him come here, slap him in the eye with the tomato for all the wickedness we do to Jamaican <laughs> people. <laughs> <laughs> yes, all right, my brother. Blessings still. The phone lines are blaze up. All right, big up yourself. Yes, all right. Thank you, yes, sir. sir. Yes, Lord Jesus, my brother, subscribers. What a way the phone lines are blazing up, Lord Jesus. Welcome to Jamaica. I tap it your life on the ear. What are you going on? Good night. Good night. Yes, why? Well, as far as I see this thing, a Jamaican people know love themselves, you know, because first thing, PMP shouldn't have no competition. To this prime minister, you yeah, deal with the country. True, true. PMP should have no competition to win. Them people can all of themselves and, and make and make and do all this. Matter of fact, a TV, TV election. But the anyway, yes. that was too close to PMP. Yes. You understand? Yes. Him should be come as close as that to PMP, much less to have a, a fight to win it. I agree so, with you. But listen to me, brother. Remember, say, listen to me. Let uh, uh, I ask you one question. You remember, see one yeah. video out where I talk about it, we and Lonesome talk about it, couple people talk about it. Say, two o'clock and four o'clock a morning, Devon out in the road I beg people for vote, for him and tell people for vote for this. And my brother, as the election done, you come out and I tell the people I'm saying nobody come ask you for the salary. How would the rat it call? How would the rat clock this? I'm sorry, you know, but I have a customer. How would the rat How would the what? How are really a guandua? I'm sure that I'm going to put more on the people's salary. 
You might have about no, no salary. No, but remember, say, brand, listen, brand, remember, brand, that, brand. remember, say, politicians just get, well, I remember politicians pay just raise. Remember politicians pay raise, just raise. 20, well, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Reno, a 19 and 20 million them I get. For the year 19 and 20, and can't get the teacher and the nurse. Hello, me did tell him, he said, This is a dirty man, you know. He no care about education, you know. Come in, you know, if you can't care about education, you're not going to come tell the teacher, them say them can't get their money. Oh, what do you want to that clock? This is a dirty man. Jamaica can't protest for him left office. One of Jamaica should have marched on in Jamaica for him just left office. No, 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 the no, wicked man, brother, man, wicked me, man. Me come like saying him really tied down the people, my the people him not love themselves. Oh, no for love on the self and still. Oh, what do you want to say that cloud he said, oh, my brother? Me, me can't understand this yeah, in general. We should have that close competition, not even as near as that motor we have by two winnings. You see me? Well, you know what? If you remember, say, um, someday I come up, general election I come up. What more, Mister Mister Guman? Well, yeah. the pan pan and peas and cues. Let me ask you another question. Let me ask you another question. Let me ask you another question. You forget, say, I yeah. Devon, I walk up and down, and I open market where I cost millions, and say, I go open market where I cost yeah. billions, and I go open market here, so I'm there, so. But you can't pay the teacher them and the nurse them. No, sir. No, 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 sir. It not go work. Right now. T teacher, teacher, one one man, they slag of it right now. Where him kind of, them same study too much and mad. Yes. And him can remember saying teacher and the oldest in a grade yet. Right now, him there slag of it one little. I and saw me, that. I'm going to interview him with me saying I'm going to send it out, make him, make him, I make, saw him that. make the prime minister see it. I saw that somebody sent it to me, make me play it tonight. Somebody sent it to me if you have it. Right. I remember where you find it. Send it to me, make me play it banya tonight. Oh, uh, all right. Blessings to your car. Yeah, they're going to look for you to send to your teacher. So yeah. enjoy the rest of the night with the students. Thank you, my brother. Thank you very much. Blessings, blessings. What a wicked dirty man. Good night, Carla. What a wicked dirty oh, man. Good night, Carla. What a oh, 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 your friend, Devon, so wicked, Carla. Lady, why you can't talk to your friend? What? Jamaica people no have no sense in us, no for them, you know. For me, no say they are wicked. Look on in nose. In nose can't take any whole of Jamaica. Hey, <laughs> what were you saying? Me say in nose can't take any whole of Jamaica. No, I make a put pan in nose. I say in nose big that it can't take in the whole of Jamaica. But Jesus lady, talk to me now. You, you remember how Devon, I walk and tell people, say, FEM government to fix the economy. And the economy are doing well. The economy is doing well. And, and this, and the JLP is fixing the economy. And the economy, and the economy, and everything you ask the labor right them, them talk to the economy are doing well. So since the economy is doing well, my friend, why they wanna come out now, come tell the teacher and the nurse them and, and the policeman them and this and the firefighter them so them can't get their money and not for asking for no money because it's like a collapse wicked. system. Wicked devil, wicked. He wants some tomato. He wants to wicked. red tomato with rotten for who are putting me eye. A whop wickedness out of him. A wicked. You know, your own girlfriend want me to do him. <laughs> what, what is it? What is it? <laughs> what is it, <a> lady? <laughs> Don't say what we say. <laughs> me say girlfriend. A wicked. Where, what is it? Where, where you say? Where you say? So you have a girlfriend? Woman and a girlfriend. You're a wicked devon there. So what? Uh, <laughs> and then teach the police still have more to him. And he's going to talk now. Never hear the Prime Minister there a uh, campaign night before the election till 4 o'clock in the morning. People set up 2 o'clock for devon come there. 
the van of hello, Mr. Lady, me no know what I'm to this man yeah. This Lord Jesus lady, you talk some things in you know, my now go trouble you. What a way you care. Hey, lady, what a way you stir up the line, but they van a wicked for true. They van a wicked. So you go vote for in the next election. Me never vote for him, and I would never vote for him. You see, if me be a labor right, me will not give the van me vote. But then the business, them have vote for him, said we a sister. Me know, oh, hello, it come like a tie the pee. You believe I can't them where my light up, sister? Licky, licky, one bag of 30, one bag of feed, 25 chicken, and next election, you know, get it till the next election. So you nothing, know, you nothing, know, you nothing. Know, you, know, you think the light up can them and the and the, the, the table them where them are go and jump and 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 rum and 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 sacrifice and all kind of uh, bread bread pan table and all kind of something. You think that will long the Jamaican people them sister? Cause the people them can't supply now wicked and deaf and dumb to themselves, man. Right. You all wicked in was bigger, bigger, big like a him. Big Antonio, we can't hold a Jamaica beef with them. <laughs> hey, Lord, my friend, well, all right. Big up yourself, my friend, and thanks for calling. The phone lines are blazing. Make a take for more call, all right? Big up yourself, too. Blessings, Lord Jesus. I said, the lady, what a way this lady has come talk up the, the mix up. I'm glad them can't say I never meet her. I don't say nothing, Master. Nobody can call my name. I don't say nothing at all at the lady. I talk up the things. Them What a precious memories how they linger. Call me my viewers and subscribers 8765396220. Call me 8765396220. Give me a WhatsApp call. Good night, call your life and Jamaica at topic. Patrick, man. Oh, blessings to you, Patrick. Talk up loud. Oh, it sounds like Devon Obi a wall so you can't talk. Talk up loud, Patrick. And I met Devon Obi a wall you down. Uh, uh. Let me tell you, man, like I said, you see, when you have a, a nation of people who can, can debate, yes. this election shouldn't be so close. And so you are saying... You see, when you have a chance to win this, when this, when this, this big news man put on for Jamaican people, the election should be... I don't know, maybe it's seen win. Yes. So you said the election shouldn't, shouldn't be so close. You can't blame, can blame um, 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 Devon. You have to blame the people, man. The people are myself. You know, see for yourself. So you... You don't even... You don't even have the general election come by the same thing, you know, because when you have a people can't be bad. This is the thing that happened. Jimmy can't be bad. With one night dinner. On a belly full. You need to stop, you know. You need, need to stop the tour. Yeah. Huh? I say need to stop for two the people I need to stop sell out them vote and stop sell them sell short. They need to stop do it. They need to stop. Remember, brother, Patrick, remember ask you a question. You remember so four o'clock and two o'clock a morning, the man up a people yard and beg them for vote for him and vote for him party. And as the election done, you come and tell civil servants that they not for ask you for the money. Because it's gonna collapse the system. Oh the system for collapse and you say that you're fixing the election. You're fixing him, you're fixing the economy. Remember, say him a blast, say him can't fix the economy and nobody else can't fix the economy like him, you know. Remember, him said, there, you be, if he me can bring down unemployment and him can do this and him can do this and him and him and him and him and him. So the economy do well. But Patrick, you remember, said the other day, I work market, yes, sir, and him at the ground breaking for market, yes, sir. Leave one at the ground breaking and give the teacher them and the nurse and the, la, uh, the, 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 the people them their money. Talk the truth, no? Which facts you know me and every, every Jamaican is supposed to know that this man is a tricky ass man. This man is a Henry Morgan. You know see? In my brother, 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 this this uh, crocodile, we call him, you know? You know, yes. my man not up in sleep. You know see? And Jamaica is supposed to be learned, you're supposed to learn by now. You can't make this man have a pan of fingers, spin around all the way. Me, 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 I'm going to say it again. I know me flex. To the, to, the, to the result, this election should be so near. May I agree with you? May I agree with you, my brother? May I agree with you? It shouldn't even be so near for him say my teeth it. It should have been 10-2, or 10-3, ten, or, ten or whatever. Or, or one, one, pa, one parish alone, them, them should have get. May I agree with you? Oh. Uh? Well, 
the people that are sent them and, and Portland, you know, see, can be bought. You see that already because I drive one by everybody of Gram over there. Yes. You know, see. As I said before, in that topic, I know me vex him with, and I don't vex about Duan Devon. I vex about Jamaican people who, who sell out them so We as Jamaican are supposed to vote for accountability and the atrocity to vote out this man. True. When do when, when, when the Jamaican people, we are blind, you know? we see, we see, we see, we see, tell the man, it's a, a sly old fact, you know? And, and every year, every minute, this we, we Jamaican people sit down and make this man out to mark them. Mr. 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 The man is a wicked viper for two man. The man need for go man. He need for go for two man. Tell the truth now. Me say, how oh, can the man remember? Say, no, you know, say me not really. Who think could not understand the wickedness of my brother? Remember, say you just come and beg the people and say, vote for me, vote for me, you know. And as the people and vote for you, you go come out, come talk. I say nobody enough for come ask you for the money because it's a collapse. It's a collapse. Wait me and there. Oh, the backside, the place. You never know it. It's a collapse from long time. You never know, you, you don't say your economy I do well. It tell it the means a liar did I tell blinking liar then. I don't know tell liar, man I tell this man, this man I come like you see when a when a dog I chase him tail. Walk and, and trace around, everybody. Walk and trace everybody. Anyway, I can be better listen and go back in the class. Take care. Alright, my brother, blessing still, blessing still. Yes, my viewers are subscribers. Me say the man is a wicked viper. Wicked, wicked, wicked. What's it not? Me go make you hear my walk a trace people, you know, no hold on. Hold on, me make you hear my trace people. Listen to him. Me make you hear my trace people. Me know we my true word pan from both Finsack. Una go listen, hold on. And I'm Robian Williams. Nationwide news at this hour, uh, Prime Minister Holness criticizes some stakeholders who he says exploited the reckless policies of the former PNP government and are now posing as business gurus and experts on the economy. And the Prime Minister says one of the biggest challenges... Lord Jesus, they met the Ed Boy rush out. Good night to you, brother Ed Boy. How you doing, Ed Boy? Welcome to the class. Students, big up the Ed Boy. The Ed Boy is live in class with us tonight. Good night, Ed Boy. How you doing? What a bam bam. Huh. What a bam bam. Huh. Bam bam bida bam bam. What a bam bam. What a bam bam. Bam bam bida bam bam. What make you do it, Chris? What make you do it, Chris Thompson? Hey hey. Huh? Ed boy, huh? Ed boy, so you start open the fridge as you come. Student, the time I get out to the better turn out to the freezer now. Turn out to the freezer because Ed boy opened the door. Ed boy, I will Christoph Tan do now. I will Rice Man do. Bam. What a ba Well, Rice Man is one of the smartest labor rights I know in Jamaica. Yes. Right? Yes. Rice Man say they teased the election from him up uh, Ginger Rich. Yes. Right? Now, let me help you and help Jamaica. Ginger Rich. Is one of the strongest GLP divisions in West Virginia and St. Andrew. Yes, yes. Yes. However, Ginger Ridge has traditionally supported the, been more leaning towards the PNP over the last 20 years because Portia, that's actually the era that Portia is from, you know. Yes. Yeah. Woodall, Woodall is through that, that area. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the councillor, John, um, John Wilson, Wilson who is, the man has been in the era for many years, yeah? Yes. Ran, been running that division for many, many a time. And always I go close, close, close to winning. Yes. Now, let me explain to the wider public why I say what a bam bam. Yes. Because Tufton is, Tufton is accusing the EOJ workers of tampering with the election. Yes, me hear it. On top of that, Ed Boy, him say him a go carry it, go up privy council. And me want to ask him, yeah. if you go up privy council about election, we are going to ask privy council for ask you about the $695 billion 
that is unaccounted for under your no, ministry? No, he's going to go to the Supreme Court for the election petition. But here, what is going to happen? Yes. Let me help Jamaica. Christoph then has opened what is called Pandora's box. Yes. Yeah? And I'm sure they read a lot of... Because what is hurting um, Riceman, you know, is that he has lost his strongest division. Yes. That is the problem for him, you know. This is e this is an ego matter. Yes. Because when you're going to accuse EOJ workers of tampering with with with, with the polling process. No. Let's let's help him. The the PNP lost in South Barra by four three vote. You know, you hear them complain about tampering, right? Yes. They lost in Edwin Myers division in Landway by seven vote. You know, you hear them complain about tampering. Yes. Right? And they have lost Many of these, at least thirty percent of the divisions that the PNP lost were, were lost under twenty votes. Hello? Yes. So, so why is Christofton opening a kind of worm where this matter is concerned? Yes. Because out of the ruling of the this matter, you might have a lot more election petition cases surfacing. Yes. Yeah? Yes. So he's opening pan. Or as box without realizing, because yes. what would be the weight, the weight of the judge? If you have a sitting member of parliament is telling you you can't trust the EOJ and the GLP narrowly lost an election which the country expected them to have lost wider, then something is not adding up. Yes, yeah, let me tell you, when what I heard it, in the boy. Know, what does Christoph Dan know that the country don't know? I mean, I say it, it, it I find it very strange. That him so that him find it so hard to accept this defeat. I find it very strange that he, he find it so hard. I mean, I said to myself, say, what when the general election come and the people em whip your backside up there and move you by a mountain and drop you go drop down and they said, do the hospital where you now fix you have to go end up going now. But remember, you know, this is this this is his modus operandi when he lost um, Southwest Sentinel. In 2011, to Yugo Buchanan by about 11 votes. Yes. He went from here and there to everywhere, to every court house he could go, and he still lost in court. Huh? Yes. So, so th this man is accustomed to losing, but I want to thank him for giving the PNP a gift because he's going to make the election continue in perpetuity. Yes. And it's only going to upset the wider public because the wider public is going to say, but hold on. If you is a cabinet minister and you accuse the EOJ and say you don't trust the EOJ, yes. well, something is wrong. Something like is wrong with you. Can can sit in cab if Chris yeah. can sit in cabinet with the, with the prime minister and say he doesn't trust the EOJ, then we, the wider public, must ask, so what do they know about the EOJ that we don't know? That's right, eh? because him, him good and talk about it, you know, Ed Boy says something nefarious activities are up with them and they're winning seats and they're winning counts. So him, I wonder if I just said trick a play for him too. Exactly, and that is why I'm saying he has opened Pandora's box. Yes. But... Let, let me go to part two quickly. I see last night you brought on um, my good friend. Let me congratulate him on being elevated mayor of Clarendon, Joel Williams. Yes. Um, Joel, Joel has, even though Joel never consider your first, but me, let me finish first because I'm going to deal with that. Because you are not no second best. You are first best. Eh? When... What they did to Joel, right, is that they have made Joel mayor because they want to give Feda the seat, yes. one tile the seat. But let me let me just help one tile and remind him that Clarendon is a very closely knitted community. Yeah. Yes. And these people, these people, no matter how, oh, matter of fact, they don't like Andrews. Central yes. client that never have never supported. But them not say, but them not say, yeah. come from down a Savannah Cross in a in a Clarendon. Say? Them say, them not say that Feda come from one place named Savannah or Savannah Cross somewhere down in a Clarendon. 
Yes, but that Savannah Cross is in South East and not, and not Central. Mm -hmm. Yeah? All right, so hold, on, Ed boy, we, hold on, Ed boy. We have an Ed girl that joined on the other line. Hold on. Bring her on, please. Bring on my sister. Yes, good yeah. night, Ed girl. Welcome to the class. Good night. How are you doing? <laughs> Good night, everyone. Good night, head boy. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, Continue, head boy. All right. Proceed, proceed, head boy. Yeah. Yes, I'm saying, even though he's from Savannah, if you listen, the, this is where the bam bam is going to happen. Yes. When you listen the the swearing ceremony, did you get a chance to listen to Mike Henry's speech? No, I didn't get a chance to listen to it. Oh, okay, well, I did. At this speech, in this speech, Mike Henry was congratulating Joel on his elevation as, as mayor. Yes. But he made it clear in his speech that though you are elevated as mayor, it is always my view and belief that you would have been the best member of parliament for Central Clarendon. Yes. So he's still putting so it out there that Mike he... Is He's virtually marking the sun. Yes. Marking the line in the sun that Joel is going to become the next member of parliament. So very in very short order, we will have a situation in Central Clarendon where there's going to be a great, a serious infighting. Yes. Yeah? Because, because Mike wants Joel, but Andrew wants Feather. And now, is is mm -hmm. who control the delegates. The delegates are controlled by Mike and his wife. Yes. So how that going to work now? So how that going to work? Because hold on the head boy, hold on. So hold on the head boy. So how that going to work now? Because if my control the delegates and a theme place, and we know Devon, domineering Devon, domineering dictator Devon, Triple D, we know him. If him said that him want, because Feda is his one toilet, a, a theme toilet that you know, him personal toilet that you know, Feda. <laughs> <laughs> I'm one. Yes, <laughs> no, you're a film one toilet. Tell the truth, remember, you head boy. But hold on, I never in a film constituency, my groom, Feda. So why I'm care Feda and bring Feda go go gone down in a wait name there? In, 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 in a car, Feda is like a, a real Feda. Well, well, and the head 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 me to say head something? Nobody well, could force head. me to go in. No, out of all the constituencies in well, Jamaica. Head, Feda want to go climb down and go say him want bad up the council and don't let him become MP. Well, uh, Ed let girl, me uh, help him. Ed girl, I beg for chipping. Ed girl, what are you saying? Yes, yes. Yes. Um, I, th I think I think the Prime Minister was with, uh, uh, let me say between Iraq and a hard place because of what transpired with um, the Mr. Any situation. However, Head Boy is well aware that um, the PM cannot push around Mike. And there's a lot of things that Mike wanted to do that whether or not the PM like it because he never liked Mike, he never allowed it to happen. So he may have planned to Clarendon for a certain kind of way. Mm -hmm. So now that him have a yes man or a yes sir, because if he never liked Mike and the job is groomed, under Mike, so he have the characteristics of Mike. He knows the history. He's going to get a lot of pushback from Joel. So who better to put in the position than somebody that he can manipulate? And a yes, sir, that anytime he said jump, all you need to hear is oh, hi. But you let understand? me ask a question. But, I but do... the drawback of that, when them put out Winston Maraj. I'm going to put the question to both head girl and head boy first, and then anybody can answer, right? Anyone only can answer first. Mm -hmm. When them put out Winston Maraj, head boy, let me make it clear. I do business round them, you know. I wouldn't mind Devon going to every parish go do this. Well done, Devon. <laughs> round of applause. Well done. Well done, well Devon. Done. I wouldn't mind you go do this in a every parish. But head boy, yeah, head girl, when Devon go ahead and do this now and trouble all Winston Maraj and team people, no problem him a create with Winston Maraj set aside a JLP labor rights them. Talk the truth now, head boy. Winston yes. Maraj and a JLP yes. before, uh, before, yes. before Devon come round. Clarendon is not yeah, one of the know. parish that flip. That, that, that is a flip-flop parish. Um, Clarendon is known as a diotic parish. If any other parish flip, I've never in all my life been in Clarendon yet a Clarendon flip. Probably head boy knows something me don't know. But Winston Maraj from me a Gyalo. Me know Winston Maraj. 
Rocky Point people know him by the by the back of their hand, by the skin of him, then teeth they know him. Mm. And then people there, them die out, them love him. And I think he's gonna pose a serious problem with the whole Clarendon. Just like what happened with the Moko division, I think you're gonna have that problem because the people them them used to them their member, them love them member, the man become a part of them family, the man know each and every one by so not because Feder might come from Savannah. People at Savannah know him. Me never know Feder until me come at home. Me didn't even know say Feder come from Clarendon. and I was shocked when I heard. Mm-hmm. And I'm not really much in politics, but I know people who are around people. You understand? And me, as a picnic, I remember some of the faces that used to come around in my era with Mike Henry. I mean, the picnic them time there. You understand? So I think it's going to cause a serious problem with them. Um, with them. And listen, if I, if I even up until my deathbed, I'm telling you, the people of Clarendon, they're going to honor Mike Henry's word. And then them say, Joel Lemoyne, the Prime Minister either go give up him seat or him a go allow the people to forget what they want. Mike Henry, they want. Anybody Mike Henry say, they mag go for. But the situation with um, marriage, it just made the situation even worse. It just escalated. Mm-hmm. That's, that, that's my, my, my view on the matter. And what, and what they have done, and I agree with that girl 150%. Yes. I am not going to be open now. Labor business because yes. that's not my party. Yes, but it's grave. This it's a grave disrespect to to Winston who has served Winston, the Labour yes, Party all it his is. life. Yes, let me help. Let me help people and understand. The mayor is from Mitchell, Mitchelton. Yes, the former mayor. Mitchelton. Yes, his family, his family, they are the backbone. They were the backbone of Buster and Yushira. Mm. Okay. Yes. Let me show you how far they're how far and they're they're still large in that area. area too. When you looked, when you looked at Maraj the day, first of all, I looked at him short, and me know Maraj. Maraj never looked like him even dressed ready for the day. Looked like he was not even there. Yeah. Yes. You could see, you could see the obvious vexation on his face. That was when the that was when the culture was being that was when the mayor was being sworn in. Yes, man. The man must vex. The, the man must vex. And Devon, you know, I must leave Devon. Go and continue, Devon. Continue. Right, but Edgar <laughs> is right. It is because Devon is in a rock and a hard place. And why is he in a rock and a hard place? It is obvious that they're going to give Winston Mara, uh, Winston Ennis, the deputy mayor of Kingston and St. Andrew. Mm. So mm-hmm. therefore, there is no, there is no position for Fed up. For Fed up. So I want the feather. people of Clarendon Central. And in it's fed up to that mm. feather never, feather never considered them. He was never their first choice. Yes. It's because Winston Ennis is going to become the deputy mayor. Why Feather is now looking somewhere to feather his nest. <laughs> but I want him to know that Central Clarendon people yes. and Clarendon and a whole is one of the last parish you should try to flex your muscle. Yes. Because yes. these people yeah. in Clarendon, they are one, they are very cannish. Yeah? They are very yes. defending of yes. those who are from their parish. And Central Clarendon is very and funny they can be Central Clarendon when they has ready. Every pointed out rightly. Goes whichever direction Mike and is going. Yeah? Yes. And exactly. It is Utter level of disrespect to see that because um, the Prime Minister is capitalizing on the illness that Mike Henry is going through now to do what he wanted because Central Clarendon has been promised, has been offered, has been even been up for sale. Let me repeat that I just said, no, a seat, a cell, and Central Clarendon is one of that seat. We are we are saves. Seat for sale by the highest money bidder in the JLP. Oh, we are set to backside. My viewers and subscribers, when you hear them bang around that we are going into the JLP, seat for sale. I know a seat where you sit down and I know I want parliamentary seat. You know, hit the like button. Come on, students, hit the like button. You hit the like button. Press up the like button. My viewers and subscribers, continue it, boy. 
Well, and Ed Boy, before we go, before we go, I want to take this opportunity to say Happy International Women's Day. Uh, after that, so after 12, oh, I'm yeah. did one to do it. Happy International Women's Day to all the mothers, to all the nieces, to all the good women. To all the lovely women on the live, listening today, tomorrow, whenever you're listening. Head girl, big up yourself. Happy International Women's Day. Thank Mother, you, sister, niece, you. auntie, auntie, grand aunt, everybody, big up on yourself. Happy International Women's Day. All right, proceed, head boy, as you were. And let me let me join in extending this uh, to all women who are on the live and to all women who listen to this program. And let me say that my model woman um, is and has always been Portia Simpson, you know, who has been a champion for That's women right. and for women's rights. That's right. And so I want to extend yeah. to all women. Women are the backbone of society. That's right. They are the engine of this of our society. And so I want to extend that um, that happy international women women's day to our women. Now quickly as I was discussing as I said the seat is for sale. And yes. let me tell you why. Remember, this is a seat, even though it's a JLP seat, it's a seat that I have, I'm very closely connected to. Yes. Very, when I mean very closely connected. When you look, at first, the seat was being offered to Scrappy. Yeah? You yes. know what they call Scrappy? But you hear the name before, I would have again. The big man who used to be a customs. Oh, and yes, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, 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 man. Walk, man. The man who love work. Right. Yeah. So he was being offered the seat first, and yeah. I'm told it was he he was coming with an offer of fifty million for the seat. Fifty million. Yeah. Well, and the fifty and million. Well, and the head boy, you can't make that pass. I we know you that one, the load man. Fifty <laughs> million dollar for seat, head girl. How are the backside this year? For the year? highest bidder. For the highest bidder, sir. Dinner so seat expensive. How are the backside? Yes, I go, I go line the seat. They then I go line the happen? seat. What did that happen? But by the way, mm. teacher, fifty million dollars. Hey, in um, some teacher, seat, teacher, bear in mind, you know yeah. that. I told you, that, that, that I, I just two years salary. Teacher, so, bear in mind, you know that current down is a gem, you know. A lot of people don't understand the wealth that Clarendon possess from yeah. up north, central to down south. All right, hold There's on a lot girl. of did. Yeah, I hear you know. Head boy, I did I ask him make him just finish. After I'm finished, you take your take back over. All okay. right, run it, head boy. Right. Okay. 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 So what I'm saying is, so it was offered to in 2020 before the man who is now in northwest who defeated um, Richard Azar. Yeah. Yes. Before he, before he was sent to that seat, he was circling um, Central Clarendon. So he was in the mix offering money for the seat as well. Yes. Yeah? This is something that I know, you know. So when he went to Northwest, he didn't go to Northwest expecting to win, you know. He went to Northwest expecting, he was really supposed to be there as a filler. Yeah? Yeah. Because it was his introduction in the parish by the leader to actually go into central Clarendon. Yeah? Yeah. So whilst they were having an election, they were busy still, Andrew was still busy trying to undermine Mike Henry in central Clarendon. So he still, so still consider Mike Henry a threat then? Yeah. Who wouldn't? Mike Henry has the largest delegate base as a C. Remember how the GLP works? You know? The GLP doesn't really have the structures like the PNP. So, in the PNP, is the amount of groups that you have registered that determine their delegates count. Yes. In, in, mm -hmm. in the JLP, the JLP goes by your electoral performance. Yes. Yeah. So, if you win by, mm -hmm. so the margin by which you win by is what they allocate in terms of, they, they, they allocate a proportion of, for delegates. Yeah? Yes. So, the margin by which you win by, so, Warmington, Mike Henry, Babsy, um, those those constituencies, West Kingston, North, Northern, um, St. Andrew with Carl Samuda, those seats are considered South Trelawney and others where the margin has always been maybe over a thousand to two, over over thousand, over fifteen hundred has always been seats that give them large delegate counts. Mm -hmm. So the reason for for Andrew's interest in Central Clarendon 
And I want the, the labor rights of Central Clarendon to know that yeah. I know why he is interested in Central Clarendon. Tell me now. He's out of the outside, he's interested in two things. One, the economic, the economic aspect of it. Central Clarendon sits on some real prime real estate housing development land. No goal that yeah. Clarendon. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes. Right. No goal that Clarendon. Prime real estate. Prime real estate lands which have been, which have not been settled by the way. A lot of these lands have no ownership. The yes. titleship has come down in many in many instances have been passed on through generations. Yes. And um, there have been no real registration of these lands. When you look at the registration of lands, lands across too. the country, Clarendon, Saint Thomas, Portland, Saint Mary, sit as some of the four yeah. lowest parishes in terms of land registration. Yeah? That is why yeah, the land program is in true. these parishes. Yeah? So, what they, one of the interests is the land in Clarendon for, for Holness and its friends. And also mining. Understand that, that Clarendon, the central belt to the northern belt, possess some of the, the, the depth of the minor um, Ramina River. And so whenever that river comes down, it comes mm -hmm. down to the high level of, of mining activities that can take place without even doing any damage to the river. Mm -hmm. the, the second one is for political reason, which is why I talked about the delegates count. If Andrew is able to take Central Clarendon, my view is that he's expecting a challenge. Hello? He's expecting to be challenged. So yes. Central Clarendon, Central Clarendon will be very important in the Arsenal because in the two time there has been an internal contest in in, in, in the JLP, Central Clarendon has never supported him. So yeah? you will so you say yeah. somebody out for challenge Devon for him seat? He knows, he knows that picture, he knows. Well and there with the backside, yeah. Say. So well and so two so two well and oh, so that's why Devon face looks up on the night election. election you know. That's why we said to you, you know, both of us said to you that if if, if um Andrew lose the election, he's going to have a challenge. But it's a, so he knows this. And yeah. the situation is untenable right now between him and the members. Remember, even Andre was saying that when he was running, he wanted officials, delegates, but they wouldn't go for him. Yes. And the people they may not, the people in the crowd and would not go for him either. Whatever Mike and he says, he would as much as um Karen and is probably underdeveloped and underutilized in essence. People will say whatever my can we say people he, people will do. Yes. Clarendon has is a as Ed Boy was saying that a prime real estate. I was saying that Clarendon is a gem of central Jamaica. It yes. is yeah. it is close to Kingston, it is close to the northern belt uh, 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 as as Ed Boy would have said, the land is fertile. It has it has Acres and hectares of land where you never dreamed that you would have had. It has it have um one of the I think it's the longest river in Jamaica. It has it has a mineral bath. The entire top coast is fertile with um between bauxite and sugar cane, and the um I think Rocky Point is is the la is one of the largest um fishing village we have and bay. You understand? We do possess a airport base down there as well. So there's a lot of benefit that you can reap from Clarendon. But what my friend wanted to do and they would not allow him to do, because guess what? He would have full up the arsenal of Mike Henry and Mike Henry would have a bigger chip on him shoulder. Now we have to defame the man or strip him of that of that royalty that he should have gotten. A lot of things Mike Henry tried to do and Ed Boy has rightfully put it. You understand? Well, people then. look at um go on it, girl. Go on. Go on me talk after. People look at Veer and say how oh, Veer underdeveloped. There are a lot of plans growing up when we hear more from your picnic till no me hear marriage have. And now I'm coming to understand that I'm of the view now that he never liked marriage either. So why is it that Rocky Point is in the state that it is in? You understand? Why is it that Port and Cottage and Mitchell Town and New Boys is in the state? Well, New Boys are too bad, but they're in the state that they're in. Clarendon is a total dominated JLP area. 
and yes. is not so want a lack of not having representation. These people know their, their councillors, they know their parliamentarians because they are there with them in the streets. But the allocation of resources were never given to them. Well, I'm going to say something now, girl. Well, I'm going to just jump in with something then now. Because we are going to add up the class a little bit, you know. Lord Jesus. Hey, boy. Yes, teacher. No. You have Mike Henry segment at JLP. Mm-hmm. You have Ardley Shaw segment at JLP. <laughs> Because it's well, I'm gonna I'm gonna finish. You have Portland man segment of JLP. I, I, who, who else not like him again? Couple more. And now them have Mrs. Tough well, no, Tufton Rice Man. Cup. Them have Rice Man side. Tufton right side. Right well, I know. Well, I know. Same well, I know. And on top of that, them allow the protector of the, of the lodge. They they allow the large protector to take him large from around him. So long tongue warm into hello, head boy. You know, say if I want hello, students, and I wanted to type in the comments, you know what? This I'm gonna do one poll right now. Let me do one poll. And the poll I'm going to be doing right now is do you think that if Devon is challenged that he will lose the election? That is the poll I'm asking you. Get ready for your answer. Do you think do you think that if Devon is challenged for leadership of the JLP, do will hold on there of the JLP? All right, let me fix it this way. If Devon is challenged for leadership at the JLP, do you think that he'll lose? That is a question. If Devon is challenged for leadership at the JLP, do win. you think he would, he would win. win? That's right. Do you think he would yeah. win? Thank yeah. you so much, head boy. Thank you so much for the structure. Mm -hmm. So the question I'm asking you, and the question for the poll is, if Devon, we know who Devon is, big knows domineering dictator Devon if Devon is challenged for leadership of the JLP do you think he would win the poll is open please feel free to participate in the poll Ed boy <laughs> you're the day one night I want me to do one poll and the poll thief 1% of the vote them yeah. <laughs> Imagine that's that's called a margin, a margin or a margin or a plus of one percent. Well, it looked like, like a devon take the margin, like a devon take the margin, I take the plus because me the one poll and the poll was 50 50. The poll was 50 oh, wow. 50. What, you what is what teacher, what is telling JLP? Then we are watching my line of vote, no? <laughs> <laughs> but I want to the same point you asked about who is Alright, well, and again, well, and a second, well, and a second, Ed Boy, let me just repeat the question. Let me just repeat the question, students. Let me just repeat the question again. Let me repeat the question. Alright, you know, so maybe become a DDC if him did win for it. The question is. If Devon is challenged for leadership of the JLP, do you think he would win? That is the question. Let me repeat the question once more. The no, question, no, no, you would do it. Do you, that is a question. This is a question. The question is, if Devon is challenged for leadership of the JLP, do you think he would win? Yes or no? That is a question. You can click yes or no in the poll. Please proceed. Continue, head boy or head girl. What you labor right well, the moon out? I am saying quickly on the matter of, of the cliques because I want you you call some names, right? Yes. All those names are working apart in one team. Yes. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Yes. They have yes. one mission. Forget they whatever. have one mission. And that is to elect Chris elect Riceman as their leader. Make no mistake about that. So yeah? what? Rice man is the rice man is being supported by them. Well, and Ed boy, Ed boy, what Ed boy, Ed boy, Ed boy, Ed boy, Ed boy, Ed boy. So you mean to tell me that you're jumping out a frying pan and jumping a fire, Ed boy? You mean to tell me? That the JLP is jumping out a frying pan and jumping a fire. Where, where, look, where rice man do for the hospital for him want to be prime minister? Where the what's it not clock this as students? No, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. 
And let me sound sarcastic. Do you know that Rice Man is one of the best performing ministers of the JLP? Yes, it, yes. No, be best performing in a what? Best performing. No, best performing in a what? In in what way? For social media and PR stunting. No, he was always uh, no, like no, no, um, a teacher. No, it, 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 no it, 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 a girl, a girl, a girl, a girl. Say, Ed Boy, you agree with me there. After PR stunting. No, he hit the nail on the head. But them always love him. People this. always love him. I don't know why they love him. Because people who will love who, people will love, people will love who they see more. Let me ask you a question. If you go a well, foreign, are you know, are you see, are you see Grace Tin Mackerel, are you see one need a brand Tin Mackerel, which Tin Mackerel you going to choose? No Tin Mackerel where you know. Uh, where you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. So if everybody has a Christoph Tanti, where, where him do? Him not doing nothing at all. A PR stunting him, yeah, and that's why they don't like him, and they don't like them one another because the two of them are, are, are take photo apps, and I say who can beat who for take the most picture. <laughs> but let me help you. Let me help you by by agreeing with you that I, I am not saying the man is a performer, you know, and I did not, and I did not specify what sort of performance I was speaking of. Performance, yes, yeah? <laughs> because it is obvious that he is old doing PR stunting but I'm saying to you from an internal point of view within the JLP yes. he's seen as someone who would be able to challenge um, Devon in terms of the same liability he's quite light mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. in, in terms of the same stunting abilities he's quite versed with marketing a matter of fact he has a better marketing than Devon Huh? Mm. Mm -hmm. so, so he is being supported but you realize the man out in St. Thomas changed him tune because even though all of these persons have ambitions and one and would have um, fostered a challenge against him you know what's one of the, one of the things that they, none of them have but I don't know, the they presence, the have, marketing. They don't have no balls. They don't have no <laughs> balls, man. You think they have the balls to challenge you? Well, if you want, let's reveal who they be. So then they can reveal him back to, hello. So, hold on. What would be benefit? Do you know a lot of the corruption that you see happening has been sanctioned by Devon? You, you have allowed that? them to do what they're doing. Why do you think you're allowing them to do what they're doing? So that they can have dirt on them. Yes, not call it dirt on them. So them can't rise Remember up against now, him. I know Professor Tracy, Tracy, Andre, you know. Andre, Andre told you that's how they operate. They gather information on you. And they use it. Yes. Hence why Ennis, mm -hmm. Ennis, 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 why Ennis has gone back home to the jail. It's not because they're going to give him the button. Yeah. This is just maybe some of them are dirt on him. Remember, I know, say you... You did you did join up to it one time it's a do the nonsense. <laughs> so yeah. where so what are they? So where you say I wall them wall wall them wall him sin over him head. I wall them wall mm -hmm. any sin over him head make him sound like Trimbleina cousin so if you want to understand oh. who who Devon and Shevan is, watch a program watch a, a series that's called House of Cards. Yes. Yes? Mm -hmm. And then you'll see exactly you'll see exactly how they operate. Yeah? They have dirt on everybody. Yes. And they make sure that that dirt is what they use. When to they leverage. To it. leverage moves. Yeah? And them do anything like yeah, that. Leverage. Them. Why would you have an outspoken person like even? And, and what is going to change the dynamics right now and can add to this competition? What if Everal Warmington decides that he is going to challenge the Prime Minister come November at conference? Nobody would have voted for Lang Tong Wab. What about in business? No, 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 it is the sturdy water when Carl Blight challenged Porsche after Atua. Porsche lost. It was not that Carl, Carl Blight knew he could not win. I remember but he that. Knew he would I... start the conversation. He knew he would start the conversation about um, transitionary leadership and yes. transition into a younger leader. Yes. Yeah. So, 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 
where he might just, if he's, he continues to, to be unhappy, he might very well do something like that. Because in each party, you can challenge the leader on the floor of the conference. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jesus, what a judgment. That is the constitution mm -hmm. of both political parties. So that could happen. That's one possibility. Yes. But but if you see a man building his defenses, you know, build defense on this year plan to war, True. and going into central mm -hmm. and is that he's planning to war. He's so he's securing himself by taking. Remember, no, no, he removed Darren Plano, you know, right? So Trelawney was never yeah. with him either. Yeah. So Trelawney has, has a high delegate base. Have you heard who's going to go to South Trelawney? Been a year yet. No. No. Okay. Exactly. I'm hearing some names circling. I won't say anything. The person is my close friend. I can confirm first to know if it is true. But, but, is but, true. but, but, but hey boy, if but it hey is. boy, it's also <laughs> ironic. Hey boy, it's also ironic that Trelawney would have been empty for far, far too long. And then he chose to fill Clarina before filling Trelawney. Why? Exactly. No, no, we can understand why no, because he's strategic in the situation. He realizes it's a give and take. If maybe if they never if the, if the if the situation with KCC, you understand? Remember say KC, remember say have a swearing in, right? Ed girl. Remember, mm -hmm. say I have a swearing yes, in right mean. now. I remember say the contention is with Clarendon. So if him not make him move no. If he never make him move now, he know that would have caused major problem for him down the road. So he would have never tried in, that. So no other opportune in, time. And yep. also, yeah, right. why he would have considered right. putting Feather at Trelawney is that he wants Feather close to him than further away from him. Mm -hmm. So birds of a feather flock together. I want you to listen to something to head boy. I want you to listen to something. Lord Jesus, I hope the audio play good. Hold on. I want you, a head girl, listen to something there. Hold on, there. wait there. Oh, before you play that, I can say good night to my friend. Yeah, man, say good night to you. want say good night, man. Bless up who you want. Bless up, man. Uh, good night, Council Joy Cottrell of the Barbican Division. How are you? <laughs> say what? Get you shared. <laughs> I'm saying good night to my friend and counselor, counselor Joy Catrell. Joy, yes. what well, 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 on there? What well, on there? What well, on there? What well, on there? Joy, who? Joy Catrell. This really hurt me. From Northeast Center. I understand that because I'm a couldn't believe so anything so that they do with this. You understand? Me couldn't believe so. And all the Ennis have said disrespect and this. And just because Ennis not get deputy near again. And then why I get it. And we say we are labor right. Regardless of what. Regardless of what. Me never expect this for you. Regardless of what you should be in the party. This is an artist. This. You have to talk about independent. Independent. The blood clot. What kind of independent? He is a fucking wicked man. And I'm going to blood clot green. <laughs> <laughs> hey, she could Clap them sweet, you see? Hey, she could see clap them sweet, you see, girl. Hey, bone her in her skin, you know. See who then should hit the like button for me. If you think the woman cost the clap them sweet, hit the like button. If you think Miss Woman cost the clap them sweet, hit the like button, students. And come on, remember, so the poll are going to close. The poll is going to close in three minutes. May I close the polls at 12.25. The polls close in three minutes, all right? I remember to hit the like button. Now, Ed Boy, Devon... Is walking and showing what about some people benefited from FinSAC. And I know proposing to be, we call it financial gurus. Uh, who they want to talk? No, no, no. Howard um, Mitchell is one of them. And I believe silently he was throwing his word, his word that Mark and and um, Peter Bunting, because remember, Darren and Bunting and Darren Bunting was uh, formed. Yes, yes, you know, so that comes to my mind. Because I never know if it's true, you know, I want to say, oh, this is a dirty man. was charge. formed out of the, well, not that they benefited, benefited from FinSAC, but yes. they were formed as a way of helping persons after a while who had suffered under FinSAC, and it was really for people who wanted to, you know, put down them. 
to see if it was an investing money some small business people and they did a very good job by the way yes yeah but his he was quite disrespectful to Howard Mitchell and I think um, the country should realize that this is now um, Andrew 2.0 dictator 2.0 well and I'm play with the people in here now I want to play with the people in here man I want to play with the people I want to play with the people in here with my like Miss Jane well on alright you head girl up and this is now play listen to this over here so now I have to play it I can hear this so 4pm on Nation I don't want to hear about the nationwide as I talk the mix up. Some stakeholders who he says... Listen to this, yeah. This is Nationwide at Five. Good afternoon, I'm Cliff Hughes. And I'm Robian Williams. In Nationwide News at this hour, Prime Minister Holness criticizes some stakeholders who he says exploited the reckless policies of the former PNP government and are now posing as business gurus and experts on the economy. And the Prime Minister says one of the biggest challenges facing his government is increasing the country's productivity. The challenge I face is how to get the public bureaucracy to increase its speed of delivery. National Security Minister... This a man, why this a man, why, why this a dirty man and no go on and leave me alone, Ed Boy? Why, I want to play me the people them here, the wicked man. Hold well, on, man. I want to hear me the people them here, where I talk about. Because I'm a trace, you know. I want to play me the people them here, because I'm a trace. Listen to him like how I'm trace now. Listen to Devon. Listen to Devon, listen to Devon now, I got trace. Now to the details. Prime Minister Andrew Holness is slamming some stakeholders who he says exploited the reckless policies of the former PNP administration to ensure their own corporate success. But they are now posing as business gurus and experts on the economy. The Prime Minister leveled the criticism against the PNP's management of the economy in the 1990s while addressing the Amber Group launchpad at the University of Technology on Wednesday. Nuragi Banton reports. According to Prime Minister Holness, some of those individuals who benefited from the PNP policies of the 1990s, which hurt the masses, should be called out for their current posture on the JLP administration's management of the country's affairs. If you were a bank, if you were an investment house, if you were a securities dealer, if you were in any way minded to do investments, did not have to think up of a new product, a new app. You, you didn't have to innovate. All you needed to do was to take the little money that you have. And they say invest, but that's not what they were doing. That's not investing, precisely. They just lend it to the government. The Prime Minister elaborated on his point as he criticized so-called experts on current happenings in the economy. Mr. Holness called on outspoken public commentator and former private sector organization of Jamaica President Howard Mitchell, who was in attendance at the function, to take note of the history of some of the current critics of the government's management of the economy. Much of the businesses that we have today that claim to be financial gurus, to be some, you know, wizard of economic innovation and ingenuity, that's what they came out of, including those who pontificate today about how an economy should be run and how they have a better perspective on how an economy must be run. Well, let me ask a question, the Ed boy or Ed girl. One company... Yeah. Name S S smell. You see and Ed boy wasn't yeah. wasn't for them leader wasn't fee name caught up in a the the the, the film sack business business. I wonder if you understand what I mean. You know exactly what me attack. The money when you pack house. The money when you pack house. The money when you pack house. He was a debtor to, to, to the FinSAC. And they had to take a lot of his assets. And what they did, the, let me tell you how wicked these boys were. And they're now coming and come to. But I want to, to correct um, Mr. Holness because it's obvious that he's very good at doing propaganda. Yes, because he's not telling people who benefit from FinSAC. He's not telling more people benefit from FinSAC. Take out your, oh, your, take out your own pencil. CX. And let me jump. Let me jump a little bit, but I'm going to go right back to Finza quickly. In 2007, when the JLP came to office, you want to know what was the national debt of Jamaica? Tell me now, because he might the things, them. 
976 million US. That was the national debt. Yes. Yeah. You want to know what was the national debt by the time the JLP ended office in 2012? 1.1 trillion dollars. Well, on there. Did you hear what I said? Well, on there. I ban you. Welcome to the class. I just see a big up. How were the first class, second class, middle, 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 middle sex and sorry, yeah, sir. Well, on the students, may I get some of Ed boy. You mean to tell me that you say when PNP give over the country, when JLP take over the country in a 2007, the national debt, the debt was 976 million. 176 million US. Yes. US dollars. Just shy, just shy of a billion. And you yeah. say when them come a one point trillion something, so it tenfold, twelve, it, it elevenfold what it was before? Let me help you and remind the students what added to some of that debt. Because Holness is lying. Remember, you know, the PNP paid off the IMF. You know? And in 97, they said we will never go back to the IMF again. Because remember, the JLP yeah. in the 1980s that went to the IMF. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. So yes. they paid off that IMF debt. Hardly sure. Um, I mean, Dr. Omar Davis had a policy which was Omar let us Davis. avoid going to the IMF again for any loan. Let's yes. go to the market itself. Let's go to the market because you already had an established market. New York Stock Exchange, you had Jamaica Stock Exchange was going. You had businesses in Jamaica that you could borrow from at lower rates. Yeah? Yes. So the, the, that was one of the prescribed policy by Omar. And what, what, what occurred in when they went to office now, they raised up the debt. Remember one of the things that they did that contributed heavily to that debt? They built a bus park downtown to so how much billion dollars. Yes, yeah. that at the bus and park we sit contract. empty. The bus park we sit empty. We when you yeah, drive go downtown. Well, 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 and and well, and that, you know. that are near Port Authority. When you drive past separate I'm drive past down at Tiva yeah. back road pa Marcos Gavi drive. All of the bus the lane, carry you past water, water, water lane, water lane, water lane. Water lane. Every bus, once you're coming from Portmore and Spanish Town. It's near to the craft near it, to the craft market. Once you're coming from Portmore or Spanish Town, are you going towards the airport? Mm -hmm. Every single bus drive past that that bus station we sit down there. We empty and pop down. And not even chichin or dog you see in there. Not even rabbit you see, not even rat you see in there. I do it I take up. You know that. You know who got the contract for that. Da the contract da was to da da in, da income, da 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 incomparable enterprises, which was headed by Dudu. Da 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 da. You hear him soon come out? You hear him soon drop a roll? When him, 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 getting, him getting appeal, huh? Da him da 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 da. Well, if, if he's coming, he can come. We do. I mean... You know, I have nothing against the dudes. The dudes, a matter of fact, as a little, little young man going to primary school, I remember I used to see the dudes out in all, all this up on, on the car, no? Yes. the car at Bustamante Highway. Yes. Yeah? He was a very, uh, you, and he believed in school. I remember, I tell you, the children used to trouble me down there at Denham Town, and I used to run go to Justin, right out by his office. Yeah, no, no, Justin used to fix them one time for you. Yeah. The dudes, the dudes, yes. So Dudus is, Dudus is um, I mean, there are some negativity associated with, with, with Christopher Cole, but at the end of the day, um, the, there's, no one can deny his contribution to the social infrastructure activity in terms of um, helping the young people to go to school. Uh, there's, there's a lot of things that he has done that 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 yeah. you can look at regardless of what America was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a son of Jamaica. A lot of philanthropic work was done, you know? A lot of philanthropic work and he's always welcome to come home because he's a son of the soil. Yes. And I have the greatest respect for a lot of the the, the remember, you know, this man was able to have you Tivali was the center of entertainment since Dudus has been incarcerated. Yeah. Yes. When last in a major dance, Akiba Tivali. Tivali was the only place he could go to a dance and leave your car home, and nobody not going there. Hello, no, go yeah. and dance down there, no head boy. Yes, when I used to keep Passa Passa, 
Me go a pass 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 that was an international and, and dance boy, that you had people, people who Japan, wanted people to start from business Oda, that from yeah. yes head girl you were saying something there were persons I've heard about who wanted to start small businesses and he would have given them money to start small businesses as well so and I will for school for me here in Pieto I've heard some good stories about him to be honest mm-hmm but as we are saying now, we could talk of the things them now. Yes. So so I had I had skip I had skip all the things to go to, to, to go back to FinSac. So I said with FinSac now. The why and you see wholeness is an hypocrite at, at large. Yeah? Yes. And his thing is he's upset that Owen Mitchell and others are pointing out the economic flaws and one of the flaws that they have been pointing out to him. Is the treatment of the Jamaican workers, right? For yes. example, in, in at Amazon right now, Amazon you can get a job at Amazon without a degree. Yeah? Yes. However, when you go to work for Amazon, what do you think Amazon? They put you under a mentorship program so that yes. you can learn certain skills and you can become better in the job. What is happening in Jamaica, mm-hmm. particularly in the government service and private service? We have a lot of young people who are working, but they they are not being given the opportunity to further develop themselves yes. yeah, so that they can gain some yeah. more marketable skills. I heard him calling yeah. on the private sector to yeah. be more involved, you know, in, in, yeah. in training of, of, of their staff. And I, and I and we said that over here. We spoke about that over here. Yeah. And one day, me and Smadi have one big debate about it because the Smadi said that the private sector must be more actively involved. And I was saying to them that while the private sector do that, because you do have staff that they have that they invest in. Talk the truth now. They do send their staff to universities yeah. and bind them by yeah. agreement, both local and international. Them send them go get all yeah. kind of training and certification. So, so when it is beneficial to them or when them have a staff that they see that fits their company. Talk the truth now. And they decide that this staff has been well. We want to enhance the staff or uplift the staff to get them to which part they're supposed to be on a professional level. Them say they go get the degree that is required and them pay for it. But people were saying yeah. that they, but the person was because. saying that they should contribute to it like a fund. You know, like the, this a grace and 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 a separate and this a company that one day and carry cement would have put one one twenty or one fifty million and they contribute to a fund like that. And I said they're not going to do it because remember they're they, their profit generated and them run from profit. So they make a ball about them bottom line. Talk the truth now. So they will only make that investment in the people who work for them. They're not gonna do it for the average Jamaican. They do give away one one and two but scholarship. Also, and, and, but that is why you have to also realize uh, uh, Mr. Mitchell is, is suggesting you go this route, which is to invest through the employees and um, and then by virtue of you know, Remember, you know, Jamaica has a problem, you know, productivity. Yeah, that's yes. one. Two, our productivity is directly linked to our output in, in GDP. Yes. Right? Currently, right now, Jamaica is having a balance of payment issue. What that means? We are importing more than we're exporting, yeah. Yes. And that we have we have been and that is around about six seven billion more. We're in, we're importing than we're actually exporting. Our our export bill the other day was was nearing to a billion. Yes. Yeah? Was nearing to a billion. So we we have that balance of payment issue, and where you have the for example agricultural lands that are not being made available to farmers. Farmers are being told come off agricultural land. Um, they might take up the big big farming lands in St. Thomas and give to them friend and in Portland and in St. Mary. Yeah? So how can you have output and productivity when you are locking out the farmers who are very critical, who will play a critical role in the, pro- the output? Yeah? I don't see why Jamaica keeps on importing food. Yeah? I cannot understand how it is that we're importing some food that we can easily go in Jamaica if we engage the farmers. That is where they must take the money and do. Eh? Engage the farmers, build cold storage in almost every parish. So every parish should have at least three or four cold storage area. Eh? And you have the farmers bring the food there. 
Um, teacher. We'll have to look. Yeah. We'll have to look at that. Go ahead, Edgar. To contribute to the productivity uh, from my side, um, my years in the service, I've seen where the government does not invest in the, the younger generation or the, the, the young staff, let me put it that way. So you find out that the senior managers are the ones who are always going on courses, whether locally or internationally. Sure. So what is the problem is that when they reach retirement age or... God forbid they die. The younger persons cannot matriculate in the position because they do not have the qualifications. And with, with the underpaying jobs that we had, and that we still have, um, I believe that we were not able to facilitate learning. Um, also, it, the, the, some ministries are very have very strict regime where you may have a high level qualification, but because you never have the certificate from mine, yes. which is the management institute, um, development, whatever the government institution, they would not offer you the position. Mm -hmm. And then we start having yeah, we start having the younger people leaving, going into the private sector. And I do believe that private sector does have, offer some level of training because I've had friends who have gone and training private sector, pay them, bond them and all these things. We don't have that luxury. You understand? So I think it was a little bit disingenuous for him to to make it seem like people are not working or don't want to work. But even in the comment that he made about the salary that he he's not able to pay, you know where I'm coming from with that? So come in April, you know we're in at the end of the financial year. Come in April, we should get the last 5% of the 20% increase. So in his defense... Oh, yeah, five. He didn't say, it, but this is what I'm thinking. He said, You have five more percent to get, so you're going to get a full 20%. So we cannot give you anything more. You have teachers whose salary still has not been sorted out. Mm -hmm. You have civil servants whose still salary has not been sorted and they still have to be getting yeah. what you call um, additional. Uh, additional is not the word I'm trying to remember the exact term that they use as supplementary because to, to, they fall between two salary scale they are not on a scale just yet mm. you understand so it is affecting um and then because of that a lot of teachers and civil servants are leaving going into private sectors yes and then and then to be honest with you some of these dinosaurs in government they are not advancing the um the the the, 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 the ministries i had a run in once with a permanent secretary when i was finish up, finishing my my degree, it was asked what my degree was done in, and the statement was that it had no relevance to the ministry that I was working in at the time. And as such, it was that I wasn't going to get um, the opportunity to go and finish my um, my, my internship to get my, my, my degree. And I had to fight tooth and nail in order to go and get um, um, the acceptance. So I came and I was like, but it is it, it 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 can be used within the government sector, mm -hmm. and that is the premise on which we right. are we are able to benefit. So some of these permanent sectors and these HRs, they do not want to invest in none of the youth them in the in the ministry. They exactly. have some bright exactly. young people, and some of the things what they do too. You have entry level work, and you want people with degree. You you basically cut out the high schoolers. These entry level work should provide a grounding background and some work ethics for these people who are coming into the working world to build up them like a resume and learn from the ones who were there before. Them cut them out. Customer service officer at the lowest level, you need a degree. You're coming out of school. Customer service officer, records officer, the hotel and say, Oh, you need um five six here, you must have math. Why you need to have math? For read. Them yeah, normally ask English and maths, you know, so you need to have English and maths. But, you know, what I want to Somebody say is that, that, what I want to say, I don't remember who made the suggestion some time ago, that once the students are coming out of high school, 
let them come out of high school and matriculate and move on to some higher education. So once you leave high school, it is mandatory that you go to either a community college or a university and at least get a, an, an associate degree. That's the truth, no? So even if you do the what, associate what, degrees, I'm, I'm that is two what, of the four years. I'm, Teacher, I understand what you I understand what you're saying, you know, but you have to understand that what they're implementing now is what you call internship and then Maggie pick them monkey money. Money we can't even send them back to school. Bus fee alone and lunch in a this time I eat out all of the money. You can imagine an intern only I go home with, 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 with fifteen thousand dollar at the end of a fortnight. Come on man, and then the and then graduate interns get must be twenty thousand dollar. That can't even make up save water that forgot even class. That no make no sense. Absolutely none. I, I totally, so teacher, to I pick, totally they, agree with they need to pick and it. I believe that they're using it, the It cannot work. Because and on what salary are what? these kids going to leave high school yeah. and, and, and go when the, the mother barely can make, and the father barely can make them graduate yeah. from high school? Yeah. On this very program, so a lady said that her, her son bus fear to go to school for him he had a seven hundred dollar. Mm -hmm. Seven hundred dollar. A fourteen hundred dollar for one day. Times that by five. Times that by three. A three four months in a in a, in a term. Mm -hmm. I will not count CXC money because CXC is not cheap. Mm -mm. Fourteen times five. And if seven. you pick me at the good you, if you pick me at the good you know one all them back, yes. Matter English free and I think NCBPF must be accounts or something like so. But what if the course is that? Yeah, what if what what if that's not what the child that. wants to yeah. do? What the child wants to be at the far out of your pocket? We don't have enough scholarship in Jamaica for our children, and that's why we're picking them end up down a Ukraine because it's cheaper. When you check out and look for, and, and uh, you see when you when you live for a place like Canada, if you're a national, if you're a national um um from Canada. Your school fee are like two thousand Canadian dollar, yes. fifteen hundred Canadian dollar. You understand? When you go to Poland, when you go anywhere in Europe, at the same money, thousand dollar for school fee. And also, and here in Jamaica, it it a harm and let you get education, and every year it goes higher and higher. On what salary? And if the grassroot but man only it. got earned thirteen thousand five hundred dollars, their children will never, God forbid, but their children will never see a university, not to mention a com a com college. Not by the thirteen thousand and they come well from no cheap. Not by the thirteen thousand a month, and not when them do have a big, a rich auntie in a cherry gardens and a rich uncle in a nab. But you remember, Thank I've always much. used those two statements. You know, hear me always yep. talk about those two statements. Yep. Say, they okay. need to remove the barrier at the student loan bureau that the people them can get it. I want to get it bound your backside, bound your backside, you know, and make you know if you, you have know, a ticket, it, sir, but, but we are going to find you. Teacher, you know, in England, teacher, you, you know plan. that in England, a, if, if you take right, hold on a second, 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 just finish wrap up for a second, it, just take one minute wrap up, a girl, I make a boy take over, right? You were saying something in, about in, in England. England when you, yes, in England, when you get a student loan and you finish school and you start working, once you earn over two thousand five hundred pounds, the government automatically take back your student loan or take your salary. So even something like that, we need to mandate, put a threshold. So you take student loan. Once you come on the system and you're getting over X amount of money, mandatory them start take up money or take your salary. I'm making some of us are not paying back our student now. We can not pay it back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better needs to be done for two. The government really needs to look at it. But the PNP are here have a plan that one person from every family they're 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 purporting that plan I hear. Date and Damian Campbell with it. I'm going away trying to get Damian mm -hmm. Crawford, yes, I hear Damian Crawford with it. Crawford. That Crawford. one person per family, per household will get the opportunity to get a university degree courtesy of the state and it's a good thing that you know even though you understand yeah. it might touch the surface yeah. because the, he said the one yeah. person for the first time so if somebody get it somebody else can get it and i believe that is good mm -hmm. because most people will generally don't have a chance get an opportunity now and if that person go and use them opportunity and put it to good use 
then them can help sister and brother, whatever, whatever, whatever. So it is a good plan, and I need to hear the PNP yeah. talk some more about that. All right. That is the end of the situation. Ed Boy I'm going to ask you to wrap up this thing because I'm going to ask you to move on into the police commissioner. Yeah. And the, the police commissioner. Okay, so, 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 so quickly, I, Ed Girl has put it quite uh, um, in the same manner in terms of access to student loan. You have yeah. always been talking about that, that the barriers need to be removed, that there needs to be no guarantor. You yes. just need to go in, yes. apply, and they burn you, and then you finish school. Now, the PNP's plan is, is a plan that I am absolutely big on. Because as I, as I told you, we had worked extensively on, on education with Damian in, in, in 2020, leading up to the general election. Yes. One of the things that, that we looked at was the access to so the, the plan for the persons, the first person from the family, right, or from mm. the household, to, to attend university from that family, actually. What, what the plan would entail, if you look at the population of Jamaica, it's about, nearing about 3 million now. So, give and take, you may be looking about 30,000. It would benefit 30,000 persons per mm. year. Yeah? Yes. 30,000 persons per year over a five-year period. You'd have been sending out a 5,315. You'd have been sending out 150,000 people. That would have been a, that would have been a major university. dent. That would have been a big, big major dent if the PNP was able to do that. If my and subscribers don't talk to me now, when you talk to me, mm -hmm. the PNP, Damian Crawford said that the PNP have a plan. Say one person from every family will get the opportunity for go to university free. And you know, the based on the numbers that Ed Boy just suggesting is that they said that they'll do thirty thousand persons per year. For a total of five years. So that will mean that 150,000 Jamaicans would have get the opportunity to go to university. I believe, I believe, I believe that, it, that, 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 that chest high still, you know, 30,000 worthy for university for, for the year, you know, 30,000 people. But, That's you know, if the government is serious, if even if, if you, they're serious, if they, can, they, they can make it work or somewhere if you close look to at it, it about. If you yeah. look at it, teacher, if you look at it, let me help you, all right? For you, most of the universities in Jamaica, the government already gives them subsidies. Yeah, that's one. So the government would not necessarily be doing anything extraordinary in the, in the sense of having when it comes down to resources, because one, you already have a stake in UWE. You already give subventions to some of the universities as well. Through the university, through the through the um, university council, right? So there is there is a mechanism already in place where funding is actually going to the universities. What the problem is in some instances is that the Ministry of Education, since under this leadership, um, they have not been um, spending some of the allocations. If you look at the, that's why the Ministry of Education has so much money. Sit down all about the place, you know? mm -hmm. They are returning a, a lot of their money because then the tertiary unit which they were supposed to be spending on, that was a unit that is under severe investigation and has been hampered because what's his name? The former permanent acting permanent secretary. Well, it's yes. Doing some anki punk in there at the tertiary council. Which is very important to the to the whole transitionary period for university education. So what I'm saying is that the PNP has a plan, and the plan can work. because let me tell you something. If, if let's say you budget five billion dollars a year for for that, yeah, even ten billion, that's an investment that over the next 20, 30 year life. Span of the country. You have an educated population that reduce crime. It will reduce health. It will reduce crime, health expenses, everything. That makes sense. That makes sense. But you said, boy, that really makes sense at all. So just take one minute and wrap it up. We move on. Right. So the same amount of money that you're spending on crime is an investment. Is an investment. Is an investment that is worth. Is an investment that you can easily invest in, and the the short term. Remember. If you graduate in, in four years, so before the end of the administration, right, mm. they will mm -hmm. be seeing the first 30,000 coming out to work, meaning 
they would have graduated university within the fourth year of their program. Yeah. yeah. So this is 30,000 mm -hmm. educated bachelor degree, first degree students yeah, who are coming and ready to work. Yeah? Yes. By the end of their mm -hmm. term, of the, the fifth year, they would have had an additional 30,000 coming back into the system. Yeah? System. This yeah. was done before, so I don't know why people think it's not impossible. Michael Manley did it in the 1970s. Yes. Michael Manley mm -hmm. did it. As much as chink, dog, flea, cuss and behave, you need to listen to him sometimes when he speaks about Michael Manley. He, he said it was because of the opportunity Michael Manley created that he got a chance to go to university. Yeah? So, alone. so well. we... Michael did it because he felt it was he felt then it was necessary and we must do it again so that we can stem this culture. We need Jamaica need to become a culture where people look up. It's it, it's popular to be educated. It's popular to study. Yeah. Right now a a chopping around a place. Yeah? That's it's right. chopping mm. is 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 so unless people start to see educated people and see people who are educated and they're being elevated as well like, and don't wonder from the young people them because a lot of these young persons to have graduated from universities and in ministries in private sector and they're being held held back by by senior people so we have to also look at sure. look at that but teacher i know you want to proceed so let us proceed to the to the this, this commission on matter because it's okay like out well, of the 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 now regarding the polls i'm going to be closing the polls or those the polls should have been closed a long time ago coming the people i'm going to portland we are closed for a long time after Poland closed. Now the question or the question that we're asking if Devon is challenged for the leadership of the JLP, do you think he would win? Now, 75% said no, Devon would not win, and 24% said yes, he would win. So most of the people in this chat and most of the people who participated in the poll is making it clear that if them challenge Devon for the leadership of the JLP, he would have lose to backside and Ghana him yard. And that is what we want. So somebody must hurry up and make them challenge him and beat them backside to when them come. And at the end of the day, we just use them, refuse them, and push them out and say goodbye, JLP. We're tired of winning. No matter which one I want to come, we now use you no. Know, mash up on one another party. That's what we want. Cause we're tired of it. Anyhow, my viewers and subscribers, thank you all for participating in the poll. We're gonna move on to the next topic. Now, Ed Boy, Ed yeah. Girl, everybody know, yes, sir. everybody know Mr. 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 Fix Up Bailey, Fitz Bailey, everybody know <laughs> Fix Up Bailey. Everybody know him from mm. Dana Lee Kiss. Everybody know him mm -hmm. from the little girl over Portmore Kiss. I wish I had a case, every other case of Fix Up name, I call Fix Patrick, Up name, I call. And the Patrick faster Bailey, man, the faster Patrick man Bailey case. Yes, don't forget from Patrick, Patrick Bailey, Bailey case, Lord mm. Jesus, I never remember Patrick Bailey, no. And the one where me just remember man, is the, the pastor correction man. man where drive the big fortune and where them say fly off over spiritual mm -hmm. hill and, and hang himself. Uh, hang himself. <laughs> Peer controversy <laughs> surround such man name and such, such man, man was in the limelight. Forget commissioner. I would have jump out a frying pan and jump right in a mm -hmm. fire. Just like what them do. My brothers and subscribers don't hit the like button for me. Hit the like button for me, my brothers and subscribers. So based on what I'm hearing, head boy, I hear that they've tipped Dr. Uh, Carl Kevin Blake. Blake. Because Kevin people were mixing Blake. up Carl Blake and Clifford Blake. You know, Clifford, that one brown one, we could from traffic. Don't. Clifford is a brown yes, one. Yes, yes. He's not Clarendon, a Clarendon, a Clarendon man. Yes, yes he's the other one. We get it. Mm -hmm. So basically, you ever hear nothing about that man there yet? Oh, that's a Kevin Blake. Kevin Blake, yes. Yeah, you know about the, him? Yes, he's the, he's the IT specialist within the force. Yes. Um. So he's, he would bring a wealth of knowledge in terms of IT, you know, cybercrime. Um, yeah, which, by the way, we are seeing an increase in that, especially with the theft at the ATMs and different stuff, and people can't be scammed and so so. Most of the mm -hmm. crime you know, in Jamaica has moved away from man does a more than man try attempt to block in their account. They move now out to cyber crime. Mm -hmm. um, so I think that he would be a good inclusion. Um, I am not having much hope. 
but I also want to rejoice in saying I'm glad that it is not fixed up because fix up. I am not yeah. and I'm also not surprised. Why would they remove fix up from being in charge of crime when they need him there? Yes. Mm-hmm. So who tell him who tell him to put out put push out him head? That's why they're not even look on him. Yeah? Now did this man because, here, Dr. Mm-hmm. Kevin Blake O D PhD MSC, BSC, HON, SPQ, YABC, 123, Elemina PQRS, TUV. One Wally Pataikle back in name. <laughs> Deputy Commissioner of Police. I'm going to put up in picture. It says that Dr. Blake hold a PhD, High Commendations in Sustainable Development, a Master of Science in Computer Based Management Information System and a bachelor's degree with honors in computer science and mathematics, all obtained at the University of West Indies, Mona. He also has awarded for what well, he was also re- awarded for research excellence at the UWI. That's basically all him put up about him. But basically what we are saying, you know, mm-hmm. uh sis is somebody new and I'm sure that he's aware of the corruption that is in the force. And one of the major problems where I would have want this com- police commissioner to address, and I want you and Edgar to just take one minute and, I, and, and, and point out maybe one or two points where you think that should be first on his agenda. You understand? But for me, the mm-hmm. first thing where should have been on his agenda is to make the police them know how to deal with the civilians them proper. Because if the people them you not deal with the people and proper, the people them not go trust your inform and tell you nothing at all. Talk the truth now. The people them not go. Mm-hmm. So the police them yeah. need to stop beat people down a town when you take them goods and all kind of stuff. They need to stop that. So that is the first thing we me think you need to mm-hmm. address to the police and tell them, so listen to me. Citizens' participation is important in the fight against crime. Citizens' participation is integral. And as such, you have to treat them with respect to get their cooperation. Talk the truth now. I wish him I wish him the best of luck. I don't don't want to sound pessimistic. But when you have a minister of national security telling you to mash them up, shoot them, shoot to kill. Huh? <laughs> you the the em, the employer of Mr. Blake is the commission is the Minister of National Security. Right? Yes. And he has been telling police officers to shoot to kill. Yeah? Injure them. Nobody, nobody shoot you. Nobody, not, right? He has also seen the level of lethal force that the, the, the police is using against the, the citizens. Right? And he has not said anything for over eight years. This man has been um, for over well, six years because Bobby um, Aguintai was for two years. Yes. So for over Six, six years he has been the, the, the national security minister and he has not acted in any way to look at all this the police treat this civilian population it has to be a policy it can't just come from the force alone and it must be a governmental driven policy yeah but you can't start be. at the elm because the moment you're starting you know, remember it's at the end of the day people don't know nothing about you you know, remember, people know nothing about you. So if the first impression people say, you giving them, I wonder if you understand what I mean, because remember that you're trying to, to, to get the people's trust and confidence here. So if me sit down for my TV now, I mean, no police do all kind of people bad all the time. I mean, so one police commissioner come out for the first time. And I say, my fellow officers, you know, I'm a new commissioner, Jamaica, and the new police commissioner, you know, and I'm here to work for the citizens to try and make sure it's a crime and violence go down and to try to help you to live better and peaceful, you know. And these are the things that we plan to do. You know, your police can't really tell everybody. But you know what I mean? They might say, well, they, you know, we try to bring down this and bring down crime. You know, they normally give them look at statistics and their predictions, right? But while they're doing that, right. if him can say, and one of the key things that I would like to say is for the officers to remember to treat the civilians decent. You understand? And treat them with respect. Tell me the truth. Now, if you sit down in your yard and you hear the police commissioner, you don't know him from nowhere. You're going to say, but wait, this man I look like him sound different. At least give him the benefit of the doubt. It should have worked in him favor, lie me I tell. It wouldn't do him no harm. You're right. You're right. You're right. It wouldn't be any harm for him to, for him to, to, to express that. But you know who would be my pick for commissioner? 
Yes. And I know this is going to sound very controversial. Yes. My pick for commissioner would have been Ratigan. Your pick for commissioner would have been Ratigan. Let me ask a question. Did, did Ratigan apply for the job this time? They wouldn't give Ratigan. Me and you know would never it, give Ratigan. It didn't, it didn't apply this time around. It didn't, but have, I believe it didn't a, apply to him. It was internal. Ratigan should apply. Let me tell you why. I think that for, for you can't have a Jamaican who is one um, was a was a was a senior man in the FBI, yeah. Yes. With his level of intelligence, and you see how he presents himself, and so you see how he speaks, and how he makes presentation when he's making presentation. Your phone, your phone, drop low, yeah, everyone. Your phone, drop low. I'm all here is a presentation right. and I speak. So I'm saying you will hear when he makes his presentation and how he delivers himself and gathers his evidence and so forth. Yes. This man should have been integral. Even if you don't bring him in as the commissioner, you could have bring him in and, and, and as an advisor to that the is right. That is yeah? right. That is right. I yeah? agree with that 100%. But let me ask you a question now. Knowing the situation and him being a public advocate for a better Jamaica, and the government is opposed to the diaspora demonstrating for a better Jamaica. That in and of itself cross him off the list. No, could just start to call his spade as we not especially while this government is in power because there is no way they would ever put him as police commissioner for him come lock up the van. That is true, no? <laughs> him to Ratigan come lock up the van. So, Mr. Prime Minister, I'm really sorry, no, sir, but I have a job to do. This is a warrant to search your house. Mrs. Chevan, please come sit right here. I'm running through all. You can imagine, they want to say, you're wicked, what's sit not clot, you Teacher. So, they would have never put Ratigan there. They would have never think, you must be mad to write it up, Ed Boy. Come on. Maybe the PNP might consider that. No, I'm not saying they would, you know. I'm not. I said to you that he was my pick. I didn't say to you that this administration would agree to him. Being I, hear I would never be naive to think that. They would do that. I hear somebody say that they should that, that their pick is Adams. I've or I've said it to you some time ago and I'm going to repeat what I said. There was an international humanitarian watchdog group and they mm -hmm. expressed their concern about Mr. Adams being police commissioner because information have surfaced internationally about the rampage that he went on. You understand? And he's known internationally as one police who make theme thing talk and then questions mm -hmm. asked afterwards. You understand? So, mm -hmm. them know say, if you do something today and him warn you and you know, listen and him come find you tomorrow, People say whether you have sitting or not, him a fix your business the way you do yesterday, you know. A payback him come for, you know. Mm. And people say those kind of crime fighting strategies, even though effective with some people, it's not right for everybody. And most people might fall victim just by reason of association. Do you understand what I mean now? You have your, your, your nephew. Yes. I mean, I'm going to defend it, you know, totally, but I'm just showing you a I scenario. Totally. You have your nephew. Your nephew are one university student where I go off him university. And you can't tell him, say, no, go up on the corner, go play one domino or talk to John. Because everybody knows that that boy is a university boy in the community. I wonder if you understand what I mean. Everybody knows him, they see him walk to university. But the police don't really know him. Them see him come and see John Tama, Harry Ronde, so good to stand up there and come for everybody. And poor the little boy get caught tonight now. So it's situations like this that people were concerned about and the international watch out people and say, no, 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 no. Nobody even mentioned Adams. So I saw them put Adams uh, waiting there. But I believe that he should be he should be considered as an advisor. You know what I mean? A strategic advisor. When can say, listen to me, this is my plan. And somebody, well, I know him can say, this is my plan. Let us take them down. So. And somebody can say, no, you know what? We could not do it. So because if we do it, so casualties and then the international watchdog but because change a and put b first then a after you understand what i mean and then they will be better yeah. fix the crime that is how i think you know everybody have a role yeah, to play. if somebody true. if somebody has the experience you know and the how, technical know-how you know how you, you know adam adam became very successful in 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 countering crime and dealing with a lot of the hard criminals in jamaica you know Tell most me. of it his, his operations were intelligence gathered. Mm -hmm. yeah? 
Mm-hmm. They were intelligent led and you know who used to share information with them? Some of the same gangsters are the same community members. Yeah? Two, especially community people you in farm with Adam because they trust him. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So I am why am I I'm saying that? I'm saying that to say this that that element of the police which you have pointed to is missing because even as but as things but then people knew the police was for the community. What has happened now, people don't trust the police. And until that trust deficit is, is restored, no matter where you are coming. Yeah? And I and, and I draw people back and I, them. and I draw back to my point now. You are one police commissioner exactly. fresh fresh from the scene and nobody not know you. Come out and make the people see that hey, me look different. So if they not trust the police, them them call up at the commissioner officer and say, me want chat to the commissioner, me have something important to tell you, sir. People will do, because you have people that will know things. Talk the truth now, and we'll talk. But them know, so them not going to tell fix up, because fix up, no, this is a police and fix up. <laughs> Whoa. And then him go preach Sunday morning. <laughs> oh, Jesus. And, and wheel the tool and clot up the tool Monday evening and go a Bible study Wednesday evening. <laughs> Lord Jesus. I don't think um, um, regarding Rocky Gang, Rocky Gang would have been there last twice and I, do, I know for sure they wouldn't choose him because they don't know anything about him. And that, that scares them, that frightens them. Rocky Gang have no time spent here where anybody know anything about him. Um... So my 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 suggestion to Mr. Blake if he is if finally elected is that don't allow the bureaucracy to affect your your your, your duty because what we find out is that too many people are the commission a job for one man for doing job. Yes. Allow because when you look at it, you know, you don't get the sense that it's barely barely do criminal work. It's barely and. Devon and, uh, and, and, and and Sleepy Don't and everybody is at the job. Yes, everybody in a one <laughs> come along. Everybody in a everybody come along. Everybody at the one. Says like, it's whatever them tell him to do, him do. Yes. Whatever them tell him. Says almost like him have a sit down with them and say, all right then, what should I do? And them say, do this, do that, do that, and then come. Well, I uh, we just want to say that, um, um, and all of them something, no. Do your job. Get familiarized with the people them where you work with. If you change out some people, send some people got Timbuktu, yes. then you do what you have to do to get the work done. Another advice I would have given to him was that um, encouragement, sweet and labor, old people always say. Yes. And the police, they want them back money. Give them them back money. You understand? And provide it. There's so much money that that JCF claimed that their budget for a year time or yearly for the productivity of the workforce, but we're not seeing it. We're not seeing it in, in the workforce. You understand? Yes. You have some, 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 especially rural area, some vehicle in my drive. Yes. You have even in, a, in, 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 um, in the urban area, some vehicle, when we see some police are driving, they say, drive, they may not see the police are in a, in a vest. Yes. There, there's certain equipment that they don't have. Yes. You understand? So then it need to make sure say the money that is budgeted is spent on the force. Yes. You understand? He needs saying, I don't know how they do them stuff. And I'm not doing pretty much I know, but he needs to ensure that just like the JDF where periodically people refresh and get training whether every six months or every year. Yes. People need to upgrade them skill and give people them promotion. Yes. A lot of policemen suffer. You're going as you're going as a corporal, dead as a corporal. You're going to move from this up. No, or a constable. Bury you. Tie you up and bury yes. you. <laughs> you have to go up and fast exactly. to free yourself. But me have one of the other people who want to talk about a girl. Just finish up your statement there so because I want to yes, ask you one he question. He would have come up the ranks and he would have seen some of the hardships that the, that the, that the first um, would have had. So it's just for him to change it to boost the morale because yes. I believe the morale of the pop JCF is, is low. Yes. And I do concur with both you and Headboy regarding to how the police do treat civilians. They need to get some etiquette training and how to deal with people. You deal with old people as if they're 
them are criminal. Mm. You understand? I yeah, man, you, like you must it. have less you lethal do. forces where you use, man. You must have de escalation yeah. training, man. That is what is needed, man. De escalation. Somebody hype up a can yeah. just easy because you are the man with the firearm. You are the man. Yeah. You're just easy and humble. And you know, Sam, you know, you know me have a suggestion to. You know, let me just leave it at that. I have a suggestion for the police mm -hmm. force, you know, but I don't want to go there. Because the police... We can ask a question. Ed Boy? Yes, it in, in America and in a couple of other places, the police operate one man, one unit, for the most part, right? What do you mean one man, one unit? One man, one, one police, one police, I drive one car. I very rare, you, you know, every, you know, every day you see two police. Like in a Jamaica, you have two police, I drive two police in a one car. All the people think, in America. I think, two, I think the rule is two. I think the rule is two. No, man, majority of women see and know about and hear about, man, are one, one, one man. Okay. To so all the people in okay. America, let me ask you a question. No, mostly one police, I see a traveling in a one vehicle. And anything happen, they make alarm. And when they look at 10 vehicles come down and pure excitement and all kind of something. Yeah. You know what that does? Yeah, that, really put, that, that put more numbers on the ground. You know, Muda suggests it, boy. If Jamaica kind of adopt the same model. I know there are apprehensions because if a one police operating can engage in a bribe and nobody no know and no side man for say what is happening. That is why... The 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 the, the wearing of the what you call us up here? The wearing of the body cam and having the the police vehicle with recordings twenty four seven. Every police vehicle mm -hmm. supposed to have as you drive the you need to have to do nothing. The vehicle record once you drive out the vehicle start record. Basically, what me I say mm -hmm. is this: if let's say you have thirty thousand police in a Jamaica, right? Now we just put it at that, and each of them. Drive in a two vehicle each. So that means a fifteen thousand vehicle that depend road if you outfit everybody, right? Fifteen thousand vehicle mm -hmm. can be at so much places and no more. Why not get each officer vehicle and have thirty thousand vehicle on the ground? You know what that means? As you look and see one police car, this so. As you look and see one police car, this so. As you look and see one police. I wonder if you understand what I mean. Do you understand what me allude to? Yes. It would give Let's people... talk about the congestion regarding the cars, and that's why they had the bikes. No, the, the bike but is one, you know, but I'm just, a, I'm just a ask you if you understand, especially people in America, maybe Canada, can speak to this. When you're, de when, when you're in America, a certain place, a certain place, and anything happen, normally a one police is a patrol or doing thing or whatever, but when time anything happen... For the most part, that the two now only for police come down for you when know, look at all ten different police all kind of something and one wally per unit. Basically, what me I say is that they're saying that they're having numbers and boots on the ground because the police can't be everywhere at every time because the, the police they are so now and the two police patrolers and by time them drive go around the road something and be yes, so. What if a two vehicle there so, so one day as so, and one day as around so the road? They're better able to capture criminals. I wonder if you understand what I mean. So more vehicles on the ground automatically in in in, 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 in increase more presence. You understand what I'm getting at? It might sound a little bit complicated or me explain it, you know. But me I wonder even for the students I'm understand what I'm basically I say. No, we understand. You see the culture is different in our teacher. The culture is different. So, so when they know the, the likelihood is that they're going to get caught. So if you have the presence of the police on the road, um, that will be a serious de deterrent. Yeah? Yes. So I totally agree with you. Yeah, man, I tell you, it because makes sense, man. It makes sense because guess what? When instead of have 30,000 officers and two of them in one vehicle and only 15,000 vehicles on the road, Give each of them one one vehicle and make 30,000 vehicles. So when you look one police car, there's so a one they run the road. There's so a one they run. So the moment something I'm a one call police swarm because guess what? If a less vehicle up on the road, a less time to respond. But if there are more vehicles on the road, them respond quicker and faster. I wonder if you understand what I mean. And when one man saw one police vehicle, he must say, Lord, one police. But when he saw three, four, five police vehicles, he say, No, to backside, I take one myself. Presence matters. I, I, 
I understand what you're saying, but the culture is different and, and, and how they're trained possibly is different. All right, so you have police out there. And like sometimes they and all of we know that's for one one spot we always the police. And when they get out there, they might look money. You understand? Yes. Police right now, just look like one business. You see more outriders at funeral and you see police by road. At you, at you. you understand? You see more outriders that carry one walk, care who whatever diplomat go somewhere, more than all police the pan road. When you when you when when you're going up like up inside a morning time and uh, 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 and or you're going New Kingston and you drive past Devon House, you see them stand up with their hand in their pocket and you wonder what they stand up with their non direct traffic, then non direct traffic. Them just have the suit, stand up and look. I look in your morning. I look in your morning. I look. Man, in. I look. And when you look, you see them out uh, one on the bike, you see them sometimes slouch on the bike with the cell phone each up in them ears, a laugh and a chat, some of them are text fan. So the culture is different, teacher. And we have to, that one of the things that he has to be, he needs to regroom the JSTF. You understand? You have to be alert. So no, no, no phone can depart. I don't know. Lord Jesus, the, know. the so comments, it, the comments, the pan fire, Lord Jesus. What a way on a love the mix up in the comments. On a just love the something. What you hear them talk about this? Everybody are talking about this affair and this are So watch them. Everybody in the comments get active. You know, <laughs> them love the mix up. It's see? just a different kind of, it's a different kind of culture. And we have to change that kind of culture that we have. It was a bit laid back. Hold on a second. Me no cut your girl. Hold on a second. Hold on a girl. Give me a second. Give me a second. One of us, one of our students, said, a topic. I accidentally pressed emergency number on my phone. They called me back two times, and we're about to dispatch police to my home. At them, something they were wanting to tell me. When they call police, they some police are gonna say, "Lady, go and see if you can find one taxi if you can go to hospital." <laughs> Hey, let me tell you, me know somebody where their father died. Me know somebody where their father died and they called, died at the house. And they called police to report the death of, uh, 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 of the gentleman. And it took them two and a half hours. The nearest police station took two and a half hours to come to the house to investigate the death of the gentleman. Let me ask you a question. That that is unacceptable. So well, no, that is unacceptable. Is. But me hear somebody say something a while ago. Mr. Lily Alice said no personal phone calls allowed upon the job. Ed boy, Ed girl, let me ask you a question. We all know a CUG phones that are company phones. Where you're allowed to make only calls that the company because the company can't set it away where you can't make no calls except just within everybody within the CUG. So you can call Officer exactly. John, Officer Joe, exactly. you can call Sue. Them alone exactly. you can call. When you come to work, exactly. you put your phone in your locker and that's it. Exactly. Once you come to phone, once you come to work at eight o'clock and you sign in and you put on your uniform and you put on the government uniform, you put your phone in a locker, you pick but, up your CUG with all the government information and police information on it, and that's it. So that will make them I, more focused and alert. It, I've been saying it here because it's been on a news and I've seen it so many times. You have policemen the on duty and have the earbuds in them ears. You can't do them something there. So American and Canadian police, police are policing are two different policing. I yes. don't know if you are a boy that have a number, but I'm thinking that the recruitment for the JCF would, would seem to have fallen significantly. Yes. They don't have enough policing places. Actually, them they know that. don't. Them know that. And remember, they don't. And remember, they have suffered a high level of attrition. So every year they graduate yes. somewhere around. I think they say no, they're passing you know, over 500 police a year. That, that's both right? inadequated, boy. 500 with 500 yeah. can do that's not a drop in eye bucket. So over that's 10 years, 5,000. So over 10 years, 5,000 police company force of a, of a population and almost 3 million. But here, the, here, the, here the interesting part <coughs> how much police officers are living the force annually? They're, they're nearing anywhere between 600, 700 living a year. So there are actually more persons leaving than what they're turning in. Yes. Huh? They have Emirates. Yeah. You know that word there? Eh? Emirates, not politically. Yeah, they are police. No, but it is, it, it, it is because of how they are treated as well. One of the things... Because how they are treated. I am not. I am advocating for that the police, police teachers, nurses, the civil servants in general, 
have to be paid well. And let me tell you why. When you catch them a thief and a collect bribe, yeah? Yes. There should be no there should be no questions asked. You just give them one five ten year mm -hmm. stretch. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. No no question no question that. But if you don't pay them well, you put them in the position. To do Remember that. this is what well, um, well, well, they say, you know, he want the ministers them to perform. So if you want the civil servants to perform, you have to pay them so that they perform. They pay them. And then also there can be reduction in corruption. Uh, in corruption, yeah? Ed boy, Simple. Ed boy, you know, you know who is running the transport system now? The same police officers, them are running the transport system. The same illegal mentality of police are doing it. The amount of the amount of police man who own bus. And then me just go say, me just go say them own the most bus them. Me just me just go say them own the most bus them. No, you can't talk to for them. That bus. should never. <clears throat> but, that should but, never. But hold on. That should never but, happen. But hold on, head boy or head girl, as we talk about bus. Hold on, the head boy, head boy or head girl, money. as you talk about bus. I'm going to ask you to interject and let's just listen, listen for a moment. At some point in time ago, I was paying attention to an interview with Adams, Renito Adams, mm -hmm. and he was talking about his earlier years in the police force. And you know, say Adams say when because him say when him just start team business, you know, him serious about the work, you know, and him know say what well, he bribery did a go on them time, there, you know, and I'm just quoting what him say, you know, or paraphrasing, and the man say that. Him got, there was a popular man that had lots of buses and him said, him got take up the bus. And when them called the owner, the owner must have said to him, say, yo, don't take up my bus, you know. Don't make sure you not take up my bus, you know. And, this, and him say, must him squad it, tell him, say, don't take up the bus to Adam. And he say, me, I take it up, I mean, yeah, madam. And when him take up that backside, them transfer him from Mossy Spanish to our Kingston when that transfer him gone. We are not in our country in Ibush. A sudden vindictive that's how that. they operate. You hear me, Ed Boy or Ed Girl? Adams me here yeah. say that. Adams, Adams me here say that. They them do it in him earlier years. One of the police station me here so out of east side understand. is a dump. You can understand One why, of the police station out of east side them says a dump. Anytime you do not add they not like it, then take your fling it out there. And if anybody on the level know me at all, but you know, say no lie me at all. You have some police station that is, that policeman want them know which police station is the dump. They call them the dump. So when they tell you, say, yeah, God, dump, they say, everybody know, say, yeah, no return. Or they might say, I wait, I wait, it, boy, I do. Our head girl do. There are some police station where yeah. I just when you go to your stagnant for the rest of your life. There are police station where I they not even have superintendent. Can you imagine that? We have one at top left. The, the police station need for fix uh -huh. up still. The police need for need for reform. And I heard Sharon Robinson said to us, because I look past some of the comments them like oh not uh, Sharon said, Why blame the good kids them? When their mothers are pupa is sleeping, Chang has to go and reform the JC. Eh? Chang, thank that you very much, Chang. That is true. That somebody, is so true. Somebody but else look here, they have been, they have contributed to the underperforming of the JD. Thank you very much for undermining the leadership of the for JC. Why are you buying this level of helicopter, this heavy army equipment, like you're fighting a war? Mm. Huh? When, when what you need to do is take that money and reinvest it in the JCF, you, you, we do not need a JDF to be beefed up. You're not fighting a That's war. That's true. You're you not fighting a war. Beef Nobody beef up the JDF, JDF and I spend billions by all kind of something. We are by the country. That's, that's how the money is being thief. Thief. That's how they are the money. The thief in the money through procurement. Because they can't get that the army. The army is structured in such a way that the army I mean, of its own procurement personnel. Yeah? So when mm -hmm. JDF is buying mm -hmm. something, all it has to do is send to central government. Do the, do the procurement themselves send to central government the contract and the bill is paid? Yeah? yeah. The bill is paid. So somebody, that I'm saying, it, it is somebody within the JDF themselves is making a deal with some of these suppliers and is getting back money. Yes. 
Because I cannot understand the justification for that a Bushmaster Jeep with them by the other day. Who wish which gunman right now in Jamaica shoot up a soldier and police? There's no gunman that shoot up a soldier. What about the wally pack car with Devon by the wally pack amount V claim and I come tell you about those can be used for 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 emergencies and must be hurricane. Yeah, when me hear the man, me say with the first class, second class, is a man attack, but an emergency rescue. And hey, and the man wicked, you know, the man put on some people upon the ground and make soldiers test them, them temple and test them pulse, Mister, you know. And me I say, Mister, hey, this, no. hey, bola, 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 no, bola, bola, no. And me I say, this a man a wicked, you know. You see how far the man go for, for proving pints and showing pints and a war, me bring them for war, you know. Mr. The man, the man a paint him smoke screen good, you know, because people know, say, them big amount care that we him have. And I want to take this opportunity to bless up to all the students that are just coming into the live. I realize a number of new students just coming at the live. Big up yourself, Chris, Chris Blackwell. Big up yourself, Mother Road, Jamaican Diaspora Diva. Big up yourself, Jav, Jav, Javan JD. Big up yourself, Calligraphy. Natalie Mullins, Lily Allison, Jason Kean. Uh, big up Jason Kane from England, big up Jermian from China, big up yourself Jermian, big up Arvil Scandroft, Lord Jesus, what a wally pan name, big up <laughs> Kaden Roberts, Mar Marcia Ellison, Abi Nassar Cody, big up all of the students and Raheem Gentles, everybody sign a fast down the big up on yourself. Mm -hmm. Lady J Love, listen to me now, Ed Boy, Ed Girl. May I go a mother road, mm -hmm. God a road. May I have something to talk to you about now. May I, wanna, may I go put it up on my screen so the people can see the video where I talk about. Because I see somebody say something about Warmington, a part of the Integrity Commission. Something goes to Ed Boy or Ed Girl? It's the Oversight yeah, Committee. It's the Oversight Committee. He sits on the Oversight Committee. Well, all right. Since you know about it, but Ed Boy or Ed Girl, I don't know if you can look on the phone or if you can hear it. But me, I go play this a writer so, so the students them can't hear what one man attack. Because Cardo Mike attack up some things. And I want the students them listen what the man attack. Students only eat the light button at the last pint this way I touch and wrap it up. The last pint this are the night. So this last meal this one I get for the night. So make sure I'm not full in the belly. This are the last excitement for the night. Well on the students. What is an now fix? Well on there. Hit the light button for me, students. Please remember to hit the light button. I wish date this now, March 8th. All right, see. I want. Why are you looking for that teacher? The no, police no, no, no. are not surrounded. They can't deal with no level of emergency in any way, shape, or form. Yes. Our rescue mission. Yes. They are waiting on the, the fire brigade. They are waiting on JDF. They can't pull a dog out of a pit. Mm -mm. They hear me tell you? They do not have no level of equipment with them. When you check the police car, they are, 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 are firing. If I go one rope and one pickaxe, they have. The policemen them here, they're not equipped, they're not trained to do anything. Except this morning I was except, watch, uh, finish your statement. This morning was doing what? This this morning I was I was listening to um to Mode Peace and he was he was interviewing um um Admiral Admiral um Weems Gorman. Yes. And she was talking about the situation she had with a a, a lady who was, was giving birth on a boat. That yeah. she was, she started out in the navy. You understand? And these are some of the things the police come across. Yeah. They don't have enough um, women to help with certain delicate matters. Yeah. And then they say they don't have treat with anything. Then find somebody who have a heart attack. Then don't know even over who the person head much as their hand. You understand? They, if somebody do something, they can't even lift them up and say, all right, then since we respond first, let us try and lift the person and bring it to the nearest hospital. They can't even lift the person properly. Yes. Then they're so, they're, they're incompetent, man. Well, that is true. They need more development and they force need an overall. But anyhow, big up yourself, BCM, a moderator. Big up yourself, Colleen Watt. Big up yourself, Florence Brown. All of the students, them, Karen Fife, Osea Phipps, Marcia Ellis, everybody big up yourself. Students, I want you to look by your screen. Ed boy, Ed girl, I don't know if you can mm -hmm. watch on the screen or watch what I want, but I'm going to play this. Make the students yeah, hear that mix up here. Mm -hmm. Students, you hit the like button for me and listen to that mix up here. Now, after you listen to the mix up, we are going to talk at the last stop at this. Listen to this and mix up on the screen now. Listen. Jamaica people, no man, you can't make up this Jamaica. You mean to tell me all this time? No audio, no audio. The little flea, Everal Cockroach Earl Warmington. 
was a member of the Integrity Commission. Jamaica, you can't make up this. You mean to tell me Everal cockroach warming time was a member of the Integrity Commission? Jamaica. No, sir. Jamaica. So he was he is member of parliament. Cockroach to rask. Murder! Me never know so what me turn a cockroach. No my dog chink fly and flee. Me never know my cockroach. Murder to rat it cop. He is member of the integrity commission. And he's the mem is the cabinet member in the Ministry of Construction, Planning and Work, something like that. So come on, Jamaica. In the office of the Prime Minister. Jamaica. What else he was a member of? Is Everal Cockroach Warmington a part of this six that is under investigation? Now we know why the Integrity Commission couldn't say nothing. Jamaica. I tell you, in the next two weeks, watch the bangarang we are going to ring out of Jamaica. Watch the exposition. We are going to take place. Jamaica, never me tell you so when 2024 come, you know, I'm going to see the kitchen sink dash out with the dirty water. Go and watch. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, so there you have it. This a man they say him used to be some either police, some bodyguard or some something. Now when him come him attack the things them. So which oversight committee now, Ed Boy or Ed Girl? Which oversight committee them say, uh, chink, fly and flee, uh, have? Can you explain the matter for me now, please? Come never, me just see the video and them send it to me. And I want to bring it to the student. You were making mention of it earlier okay. on, Ed Boy. Can you explain which committee? Him is a so, so, the, him, you know. so the, the, in, the integrity oversight committee, yes. right, is a committee of parliament that oversees the integrity commission. Yes. By virtue of being a member of parliament, he is appointed by the government side to sit on that committee. Yes. Yeah? So therefore, the power lies with the 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 house leader. Yeah. To to remove warming, to, to tell warming that he can no longer sit on the committee and then put on his replacement. Yes. Right? So, so it is also quite interesting. They know the behavior of this man and that this man has no integrity in terms of his behavior. Yeah? And some other things. And they would have allowed him to sit on that committee. So it tells you what they think about integrity. So, so yeah? is he still a member of the committee? No. No, he's that still, and fixing yes. business. He's still, yes, yes. He's still, still a member. is. Um, I think I think it was said in the, in the news uh, that the the IC would have met. They would have met on Monday, I believe it was, um, to um, for the meeting to submit us um, to do a submission to the House Speaker regarding removing him. So they have been working behind closed doors. As well as um, I think is the the jump Jamaica what him name again so uh, that meet meet a meter, 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 meter yeah. yeah. they are also they are also um, one of them who are who who's also lobbying for his removal from the from that committee and I think there was something else they want jump want him I think the jump also wanted him to resign. As um, the member of parliament as well. Yes. Um. I. I think. I think. I think he needs to be drawn up in that regard, and I would also think the same thing. Um, needs to be done regarding Cottrell because both of them are lay magistrate because they are JP, so they carry some level of magisterial responsibility, and that office. When you carry that office, um, your reputation should be uh, one that is without reproach. Um, you are seen as somebody of integrity and upstanding in your community, and your your relation and communication with one uh, with others should be 
of such of respect and equality. So I believe that the Prime Minister really has his hands full. I'm yet to see him say anything about the whole situation with Joy. Uh, we have not heard a public apology from her either because, I mean, the voice note is here, there, and everywhere. Um, and I haven't heard the Prime Minister say anything about that. But Warmington, he needs to he needs to go. Yeah. No. The next last final topic I want to touch on is this. Anybody know Ville Royal? The rock yes. down place. Go, 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 go. Today. I lived around the road from it. All right. So, down the road Ed, from me. So, so Ed Boy lived down the road from Ville Royal. Uh, Ed I'm Girl. What do you know? What do you know? What do you know? So Ed Boy lived down the road. They used to live down the road from Ville Royal. Uh, Ed Girl passed it today. That rotten down place where Ed Girl passed today. My friends and subscribers, mm -hmm. oh, nobody see how Ville Royal look? Me, I want video of Ville Royal pop down and stay like when Hurricane Gilbert. My friends and subscribers, so you mean to tell me that the Andrew Owens administration, Ed Boy and Ed Girl, allow Ville Royal for pop down and look so? No, when the time I think, know, I think, oh, 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 the place I think looks he was so. on this. I think he was on this. Um, I, I think he was on this show. I came on and I said a few months ago. I know I said it's in some space that that place should be um utilized as a museum or a national heritage park or something. I think he was on this show. I came on and said it some months ago. Um, and every day when you pass it, it rotten down. To the one, to the if you know where I don't remember exactly what that road name. Um, what what the road name again? Um, Head Boy. So when you come through the stoplight and you go up, go up to it, okay, you're looking directly because Lady Musgrave. Okay. Lady Musgrave. So how the roads stay, hey, um, students, when you go up to it, it looks like a dead end, but it's a deep, sharp corner. So when you go up the road, you literally yeah. steer right into Vera. You know what Vera look like today when I pass it, which me pass it most even. Like, you know, when you button down from Hurricane, mm. I saw them button it down from top to bottom, ply blue. <laughs> I mean, it's a national disgrace. This place should have been, a, just like how you have um, Devon House, it yes. should be a, 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 a museum or something. Well, and there, maybe I'm just students there. Well, and there, who was here up the look? Who wants to open look? If you want to see how it look, hit the like button and type in there to show me teacher. If you want to see how it looks, students, if you want to see how a veil royal, you know, say the prime minister must be held account for this. You know, say him should not take care of that place, but him not take care of it, you know, a Beverly Hills in business boat, you know. A Beverly Hills, them business boat. Teacher, I'm going to run. Yes, boy. All right. Yes. Right. Um, the, the, the outside, the inside, based upon what, um, Shartnick said, and I, and I don't Shartnick believe he has any reasons to lie. Um, he said that in, because Julian Robinson had questioned him and also Lisa and, uh, and Natalie, and he, and he said that the outside part is dropping down because yes, the, the outside is, uh, I think I forget what they call it, but it is, it is designed, it's a design that's outside, but inside is intact, yeah? But the outside is what is falling down because they were supposed to do some work to it a long time to restore the outside. So let me yeah? ask you a question, Ed Boy. If when you it's come, if anybody fun. come at your yard or pass your gate, I would them see first, not the outside. So let me ask you a question. So when you comfortable walk out and walk in or pass it and see the to you, at least they want to slap with two tomatoes, you see. I better them did shut them out. Exactly. To, to, to be fair, to be fair, to be fair they have, have persons cleaning the premises. I want another right, second head boy. I want another second. I'll just make head boy finish anyway, the mirror. Anyway, teacher, I'm going to, I'm going to run. And head girl, I'm going to run. Students, um, I, I got to, I got to run. Yeah, man, I say I would, man. Respect, man. Big up yourself and thanks for the time. You know, it's a time well spent, head boy. I always appreciate the time you spend over. I always respect, I always respect the time you spend over here. Big up, my brethren. Respect and enough love to you every time. Bless up, brother. Blessings. Yes, back to where that's now, Ed girl. You can imagine all the place tea and look terrible, Ed girl. Is that disgrace, you know? All right, put it this way. 
you supposed to tend to a house, somebody going to foreign. Let us use the, 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 that analogy. Somebody going to foreign. And y'all tell me, say, you know, see evidence of the cape or chichi or duck or wherever one leak or something. I say, boy, Miss Madge, you know, say the house a leak and the roof need to fix and the breeze, the blow around the sand, tear down the sand, chichi or eat down the so we need to get it sprayer. Or we need to get some cursing and put it on it or something. Teacher, and I yesterday that I written down. Of course, from them it coming in at eight years since the place not get no touch up, sister. Time. Listen to me. Uh, since eight years since the place come in, they not do nothing to the place. And listen to me, students. And I want you to tell me this now, Ed girl. You see, if I inside where you alone are see it pop down, then we could have said, yeah, at least you have to come inside to see it. But when it's outside, everybody has see it. Who plan for come at your yard? Who no plan for come at your yard? Who no look for come at your yard? Your friend has seen it, your neighbor has seen it, your enemy has seen it. The fact that it's outside, the damage is visible, makes it extremely worse. Nobody can, de can defute that. Nobody can refute Teacher? that. Nobody can There's refute that from outside. Every day. There's police over there every day. The lawn is kept so people are on the ground. People see this. You must have somebody who will to the property because it is it is under I think it's under some trust or something or whatever. You understand? And I'm saying you must have a property person who will come and check on the building. They're saying, um Sharp Neck is saying that inside is 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 kept and all of them something. Like the front part that we're seeing from the road is bored, right? Um, and that board, I think, would have been on it since the existence. I don't know if they did any refurbishing on it, right? He said the back of the premises is concrete. But I'm saying, where else on it that is also decaying? Because I'm thinking that it's not just so the back of the premises might have concrete, but where else on the premises have board? Yes. You know what I'm saying? So it is a matter of the persons who are responsible or the organization is responsible to tend to the property. And I don't believe that's true. I believe that just like all oh, the man from Nepal, they report the, 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 the matter with the waterman and them slung pan it. I believe there must be a gardener, there must be a painter, there must be a plumber. After, after and before every hurricane season, they must have checked the building. Because that is true. Listen, that listen to me. I just the property team goes. I just in plain incompetence. Plain incompetence. Do that. Plain incompetence. There's no question. Listen to me, Ed girl. I'm going to say it again. You see, if I inside, then you could have give an argument. Say, oh, inside, nobody now got know unless them come inside and see it. But if I outside, people now feel look for see it. Them pass and but see you know, it. You know, and the funny thing about it, the day before it got released, I passed there because I said that occasionally I do pass there. And I said to my sister, that the place they're right down and they're not fix it or they're not turn it on one museum or something. And then me shock to see the next evening, it said uh, the place had collapsed because it rotten down. It's a, guys, it's a huge premises, you know. I think the last premise who lived there was Eddie. I think I see I was the last prime minister who lived there. Because when Devon said, Devon said, nah, I'm good there. Yeah, because I do want to put Obia down there. Because I do want to put Obia down there. And the goat, with them bossy goat, down there. <laughs> and run the blood and do all kind of something. And with them set the table. And, and, and splash the rum and do all kind of something over there. And dope here, take up over there. And that's why. What woman talk to, hey, listen to me. Listen to me, Ed Girl. I say, one day... I happen to be in a one, one barber shop. And when me in the barber shop, it's a mixture between barber shop and ear salon. And them do nails and all sort mm -hmm. of something. And me now go mm -hmm. tell you how close to somewhere to half a tree. And one lady mm -hmm. come in and the lady is a Christian lady doing her. I don't remember which church and the lady attacks. Says, oh, she makes sure who and the prime minister. I must say, oh, them. I don't remember what she said. I'm not there. But based on what the lady said, she said, appear doppy up the doppy and demon yeah. something the till I king. I said, the lady talk some things, they say, man, I do man. Hey, I said, the woman talk some things, they say. Mm -hmm. Up the aunt and full of doppy. That's why they van him no one up there in a up there. Uh, I, I wouldn't be surprised. 
I wouldn't be surprised, teacher, or one of the staff or one of the police them up there released the video. You know why? Because I believe somebody would have reported it and they sat on their eye horses and nobody care. Nobody care. Because nobody now live there. But it's our heritage. It's a prime real estate property. Yes. You understand? And then it, it's just that they take up space and not, not create some revenue from them, make people make, make the pity them nowadays. Them learn a little bit more them history. Yes. You understand? Make some, some make people walk in the room and know some of the great prime ministers had, had walked through these premises before. Yes. You understand? You, you, know, you know, the Americans pride themselves. And some of the tourists, when we, we, we run Gaffer, and everybody wants to go see the White House, everybody wants to go and watch, if you go see the bull, and them something there. But nobody no want to see, but nobody no want to see Jamaica <laughs> House and Vail Royal. Nobody no want to go up at Jamaica to, House. All the Bob Marley Museum, them are go. Make them go in a Vail Royal. You understand? Make them know, say, hey, I just said, who are who they are, and this tree, the national tree, this flower, the national Hello, flower. listen to me, Ed, girl. You know, say, you, you have some understand? people in a Jamaica when know some top secret where go on. Hello, me say some, some dopey up in a veil royal. Some dopey <laughs> up in a veil, me say, from, from, from <laughs> Eddie go <laughs> Lego, the dopey and keep table. You can imagine revival table and keep. In a the, yeah, in a the official the residence teacher. of the Prime Minister, me soon show it students when Ed, when Ed girl come off of the line, cause me realize from Ed girl they pan this line, pan the laptop, me can't load no, me can't download no video you from she pan the WhatsApp. You want me to call the other phone? You want me to call the other phone? Yeah, do that then. Call the other phone. Alright. Okay. Yes. Me said the month of dopey my viewers and subscribers see it load you now. I'm going to show two of my viewers and subscribers. You know what I meant to load it for now? See it here, A3. My viewers and subscribers, you know, look around the place for up a Vail Royal. Stay. Come on, students, you know, hit the like button. Hit the like button and bring the like button to 600 for me now. Come on, students, you know, hit the like button. You know what I see what I go on, I'm going to show it to you now. Hit the like button for me now, please. Altia, Dinam, big up yourself. Altia, Dinam. Blessings to you, Altia. Take care of yourself, Altia, Dinam. Big up yourself, all right? Big up yourself, Sister Altia, Dina, and blessings to you. I don't know if you're listening, but blessings to you, Sister Altia. Big up yourself every time. Well, on the students, a video of a going on. Well, on. Me want to show you up, up at the place to you. Devon, having have 800 billion dollar apartment and, and, and how much billions of dollars. That's why they're not busy about the place. That's why them do not business about the place because them have them eight hundred million dollar, eight hundred billion dollar apartments at the place. No matter to them, what are my viewers and subscribers? All wicked them. What are my viewers and subscribers? Let me see. I wish I'm put this out there. Hold on. Video March here, yeah. but it's supposed to there, so it's safe already. Okay. What are my viewers and subscribers? Let me put it right as a show. No, up at the place there. Them should have shame of themselves. The amount of money where them get her, the amount of money where them have. Them could have do better with the place. I know them should have mandate them for live there. Them should have mandate them say from your prime minister here for go they go live. Hello, listen to me. Stop giving stop giving me a problem. I wonder why they never know I'm for sure there's something. All of my viewers and subscribers. The video, they done the video load. I don't know out of the blues. Me I try to load the video on it now. Nah, load. You know, all our students, when I show you what going up at Vail Royal. I wait, 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 wait. I remember if you hit the like button, students. Yes, yeah, see it come up here now. Hit the like button, my viewers and subscribers. Me I will not go fast up there. You go over here, so Mr. Mr. Wicked Liar, man. You go right as a side of him. Look how up here, so look like what haunted us. Look how up here so look like what haunted house. This a look worse than giddy house up at Port Royal. Look at this and it says, where it's a writer so The government says it's currently in process of effecting temporary proactive works at Vail Royal. Yes. I lie them I tell them never did I do nothing at all. Two people bust it upon them. A two people bust the video. We know them I got to tell lies. Say, oh, them did plan for fix it. Them is a one blinking backside set a liar. I just two people bust the excitement and show them a go out with my brother subscribers. When to look how up at the place, look and stay. Look how up at the place, look and stay, my brother subscribers. When to look there, well, and they make me show, you know. 
When you have to hit the like button, you know, come on students, hit the like button for me there. And the last thing, this mega show you know, for tonight. I want to tell me if this is not one big big city. This is like the White House, you know. This is the place where the... When you look at the front tight there with all the front are popped down. It don't look like one hurricane just passed. Look on the front tight, my brother, subscribe. Before I play the video, look on the front of the place. Look how it look mashed down and popped down. Before I play the video, you know, look how it look mashed down. I wonder if I did dopey them and mash it down. I wonder if I did dopey them where Eddie left up there. I wonder if I did dopey where Babsy left up there because them got jump revival and left the dopey them up there. Me I wonder if I did dopey make up there look so, so, so haunted and tormented and look like one auntie does. My brother subscribers, you know, look how the place there. Let me play the video now. Look here. Look how this look like one auntie does. Look out upon this, so. If somebody a pass this, so. Them the most is said they have popped down long time. Who don't talk to me now? So, so everybody passes every day and she said this a pop up down and nobody not say nothing at all. No, man. The people, them, somebody for well accountable for this, so. Because the government place the official residents can't look, so. The official residents can't look, so. Look upon it, students. So I want to type in the comments and tell me what you think. You know, this look like what Auntie does still. This look like Rosal Great, the white witch of Rosal Great House. Can you have some dead witch or you have live witch? Can you have some people where live and them a witch to, to all them be if them a witch? But no matter how the witch, them can't cast them spell. The blood of Jesus cover you. No spell where no witch cast can't can overcome you. No spell when no witch cares can overcome your my brothers and subscribers. But look how this place I look like what auntie does. And somebody said, member said Devon wife I want building contractor. Devon wife I want building contractor. All him have to say to her, say, honey, send to her your man them come touch that up for me now. Send to your man, them come fix it up. You know, so the people them don't care about Jamaica. They don't care about Jamaican people and they don't care about the official residents of the country. Where in the world you go and see what official residents look so? To the to my students were in a China, the official residents in a China look so. To one of my students where they must in a Canada, the place in a Canada look so. To the people who they in a US, the official residents in a US look so. Look here. While you're looking at the video, I want you to tell me is which category 5 hurricane come, come, come pass through, yes or no? I wish category 5 hurricane pass through Vale Royal. I wish category, I wish, 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 I
a place look pop down like some old haunted house. Lord Jesus, them should have shame of themselves. But anyway, my viewers and subscribers, let me read some of the comments there. BC says Rosal is well maintained. When you say even Rosal great horse look better than this year. A Rosal a big top place. BC says Rosal is well maintained. Florence Brown said this can't be compared with Rosal. Yeah, Rosal great horse a big top top tourist attraction. Head girl a teacher. She doesn't do renovations. So what kind? Of, I wish she do a build. She build. BC says our topic is a heritage site. Janet says Hurricane Gilbert. Florence said it look like. Dup is worth fighting and mash it up. Janice Brown said, Kanjo and his wife, Diaspora Diva say if this was on the Gold Coast in Montego Bay, it would have been maintained. No historical preservation. Shame, shame, shame. Sonia Fasta said, Devon, I'm loving life. It's a good morning. And a topic. A nasty, Devon, nasty and worthless. A true attack. Wicked, dirty, what's it not? Wicked. That's poor diva a category Devon who doesn't give a you know what. Simon Beckford say he doping him Devon and him wife. Them are wicked. Well my viewers are subscribers are almost two o'clock now we know you can call it sad two o'clock. You can call it sad two o'clock. Mr. Me hey girl, Mr. Moore's gonna make your uh, come back on the program. Me if you call you on the other four, me just remember to write it up. But I tired. I go and end the class because I tired. So students, before I go, let us bless up our head girl. Head girl, thank you so much for being my co-host tonight with Head Boy. I really appreciate you both. I said, I would make you come back on, but I tell you, I'm kind of tired to write it up. So I can just end the class now. Students, I take this opportunity to say thank you so much for making it Jamaica a topic. To all of those who liked the video, to those who shared the video, to those who called, and to all of those who type in the comment section and participated in the discussion. I appreciate you all. Thanks for listening. Thanks for your time. If you're at work, blessings to you. Big up yourself. Enjoy your day at work. Please remember, before you go, hit the like button. All right, students? Before you leave, hit the like button. To all the people in England, good morning. To all the people in China, good morning. Yes, to all of those people everywhere in the world, good morning to you from Jamaica. Our topic, today I wish they again, Saturday. Yeah, today is Saturday. To all the people who celebrate Sabbath, a happy Sabbath to you. Blessings to you. Do enjoy your day at church tomorrow. And to all of the people who are go about them business tomorrow. Blessings to you and take care. Both you and your family. The Lord bless and keep on your year. Big up everybody. Let me read some of the comments. Ermin say, Andrew not proud of the heritage places. All him care about is to burn down the heritage. Andrew are wicked. You so here's how one I'm friend own it. You could have suit yourself when I'm friend by out over there. BCA, Smith and Calligraph, Callie said no respect for the vintage design furnitures and, and school work. Edgar said, teacher, the entire front section is now covered with plyboard. Like when you're batting down for hurricane. Lord Jesus. Students, I make a big up for Ed Girl again. Come on. Make a big up for Ed Girl and tell her Ed Girl thanks so much for being my co-host. I make a big up the head boy. Bless both of them for coming tonight. Big up the head boy and big up the head girl. Zadutha, Alman, big up yourself, Zadutha. Blessings to you and everybody with the pan the light. Big up on yourself, man. Big up on yourself to the world, you know? Yes, man. I don't lie, I'm tired, do I? I'm tired. That's pretty if I say sleep late this morning. Yes, I'm tired, man. I'm go go on my... I go go my little bed and rest up now for the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting and his truth endure it to all generations. The Lord is good, the Lord is good. I say I thank you Lord, I thank you Lord that you ever thought of me. Many are the blessings that you give unto me. Blessing over stone like I might see. Lord, I want to thank you. For your love to me, I thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. That you have told of me. me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. That you have thought of me. Many are the blessings that you give unto me. Blessings over stone like a mighty sea. Lord, I want to thank you. 
all your love to bop, 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 bop. Thank you, Lord, bop, bop, bop. Thank you, Lord, bop, bop, bop. Thank you, Lord, thank you, Lord, that you ever thought of me, 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 me. I'm a student, them, them, them. Well, students, big up on yourself. Big up on yourself. The Lord is good. Michelle Miller is a wonderful job teacher. Big up Ed Boy and big up Ed Girl. Well, big up yourself, Michelle Miller. Glad you enjoyed the program. Big up yourself, Roger Reed. All of the students, somebody in the class. All of the silent listeners, them, everybody. Big up on yourself. The Lord is good and me have a sing. Me have a sing. Me and God a friend. With all kind of judgment, I got always find him way to start out my business and fix my business and fix up what go on. So, I just remember something a while ago, and as I remember something, I say, you know what, let me just give thanks. Let me just give thanks. It's not an easy road, I many see the glamour and the glitter, so them think I bed that rose, me say, who feel it knows? Woo, 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 Lord, help me or sustain the abstain these blows. Woo, woo, yes, it's not an easy road, but the Lord is with I and I. And from the Lord is with I and I. Lord Jesus, they can't stop I and I. Lord, I thank you for your goodness and your mercy. Uno lucky, uno lucky. If you remember stop my nice car, you know me stay and love God. If you ever make me start cussing at the two o'clock a morning, yeah, so you make me just stop my nice and tell a lot of thanks. Because only that set a dirty wicked. Yes, you know is a set of wicked. You know is a set of wicked and you know on yourself. But you cannot stop me because you know me and the Lord are friend. Me and the Lord are friend. Yes. The Lord knows that me and him are friend. Me now have no friend but me and the Lord is friend. Because enough time when nobody don't know me and the Lord sit down and I talk to the Lord and I tell the Lord my problem. I'm going to stay there. So you must feel like you can't stop me. You can't stop me at all. You cannot. You cannot. I pray too much. I talk to the Lord too much. I will up a time I talk to the Lord. You stay there. You don't see a topic come here. You don't go on. You don't go on. You don't stay there. The Lord is good and to The Lord is merciful unto me. Me ever beg the Lord be me hey, morning, noon, and evening, and night. Me beg the Lord merciful, merciful. As I wake up, I say, Lord be merciful unto me. Night, night, I say, mercy. So, when I go and stay there, when I look, you know, must feel like when you can't stop me. When you bother make me cuss, because when you know, I'm cuss, you know, I'm class, you know, that because you know, uncomfortable. You know, uncomfortable. Because I know dirty, nasty ways. But when you bother make me stop, because when you know, me you know, in the foolishness. But the Lord is good unto me. I have to think when he can't stop me. When I go and drop a ground and see me. Oh, uh, when I go rotten down like Veil Royal. When I go pop down like Veil Royal. Oh. Uh, if you ever make me, you know, ever make me talk the things them. If you ever make me talk up the things them in the morning and cuss, you know, and talk. With you no know, dirty nasty self. That's why I can't better. No matter where you have or you be, you cannot better. You can't because you inside one clean. You inside one, you mentality dirty. But if you think, you can't, if you think, no, you no, can't, no, listen to me. You know, you can't stop me, no. No matter what you can't try, no. Fling blow left, right, and center. It can't touch me, massa. Can't touch me, come me and got a friend. Remember me telling you, no? Oh. So before you come on, you know, I have to go and make sure I shut my mouth. I must think you can't stop. And you know, I will cuss and tell you the things them. So fast, run me and say, I will not, not, not cuss and tell the things them. But I will behave myself because I don't want the drama. With the dirty nasty self, you must feel like you can't hold me down. You must see how hard I try in life. You know, me a boy, you sit down. I try to do every right thing in life. I try to make it. And for you wait name there, you not try to hold me down. You don't feel like you can't hold me down. You don't feel like you can't hold me down. Me are too clean and the Lord know that when nobody make me cuss and, and go on by 2 o'clock in the morning and nobody make sleep, jump out of me eye again and make me cuss. I must feel like when you can't stop me. When you feel like when I never can argue with you, you know. I not argue with you and I look for you, you know. Because what the Lord have in store for me, none of you can't stop it, you know. And when I go stand up and see it, remember me tell you, I'm going to make sure you see it. All crosses. Let me shut my mouth. If you never feel like you can if you know, know how to fix you in the business. Oh. So you go on. 
When you watch the program at night time and fast and people backside blinking business for uh 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 you know, you know feelings like say well, if I ever cuss if I ever go on and say When you don't know, want to take this thing off like, if you know, if you know, ever you know what I can the Lord bless and keep on my face shine up on one of your students. The Lord bless you know I may shine, may his face shine, shine up on you know. Out of order. Out of order. We need to change your ways. Change your ways. Change your ways. And think when you can't hold down people. Change your dirty, nasty ways. You must feel like when you can't hold nothing over nobody. Else. That's why you're miserable and uncomfortable. That's why you're uncomfortable. And you know yourself. You yourself know yourself who me at all. But you know I will cause you and fix your business. So go on. You must think you can't stop me. You can't stop me. I right in front of your face. The Lord I go bless me. I make you say. And you go, you go and drop down a ground. Remember me tell you say you go pop down. You go and drop down like Veil Royal. Right before your eyes. The good, good Lord I go open my doors before. Be, before your dirty eyes them. We they look at dirty nasty ways. Your ways them dirty and nasty. That's why nobody don't want to come around Uno. No matter who you have and who you be, nobody don't want to come around Uno. Out of our town, dirty ways, you don't forget to change and look. Look. You don't have everything you don't want according to Uno. You do miserable and comfortable. You don't feel good and life not happy. You don't know how we cuss and talk to you. You don't bother draw me out in the morning. You don't out of our self. We must feel like only can't stop. We must feel like only can't stop me with the altar of self. You may look. You may must, the Lord bless you, no student. Student, all of my students, then bless you, no have a good night before I start. Because me start tonight. You know what? Uh, the Lord bless you, no, yes, student. The Lord bless you, no, and have a good, good night. I love all I want. Yes, I love the students, them. Yes, students, I love you, no, because you know, don't stress me out. I love you, no. I love you, no. Uno me love because you know stress me out and you try to hold me down. So me love Uno. So if you know what, you me tell the students, I'm going to tell them, say, yes, me love the students. I'm Uno me love, me love Uno me students them because you know try to fight against me. So me, so me love Uno. Uno me love, me students them. Out of order. But students, big up on yourself, yeah. And have on yourself a good night. Out of order. You know you can't stop me. You know that. You know you cannot. For the Lord is with me. Remember, you know, you know for yourself that the Lord is with me. And you know my ambition. You know me a boy when I sit down. You know me not sit down. You know me full of ambition. You know, you know that. Uh, so you can't go on like you know you can't hold me down. You know you cannot hold me down. Every minute, you know, you know, you know, you know, the Lord bless you. Since you watch, I hope you watch and see where you for watch. Since you watch, I hope you watch and see where you for watch. Are you going to watch you one night and see something that I go? Watch you going to put something on you one night. We're going, we're going to make you drop down. Watch you, me go. Watch you one night, me go put something on you where you go see and drop down. Wait, man, watch how one night me go put something on ya. And you go and see. Go and watch, man, and watch where you for watch. The Lord bless you, the students, before I done. Have a good night. I love all of Yes, I love all of Uno, students. I love all of Uno. Yes, me love Uno. Yes, teach I love Uno. Thank you very much. Uno not stressing me out, so me love Uno. Me love Uno. Uno not try to wall me down. And put me through all kind of judgment. So me love Uno.